Hey, mm, welcome mm. everybody. <laughs> Look, you play silly games with me, Tom Hazel. You, you get what you deserve. You get silly games. You get, <laughs> get silly, silly games. games. Speaking of which, if you donate to charity, you can get wow. lots of silly <laughs> what games. What a segue. All the silly games. Professional, right? Professional segue. <laughs> oh my god. Welcome everybody. Welcome to... Guys, yeah. what, day, what day is it? It's Friday. It's, it's Friday. Friday. <laughs> It's a Friday, dang it. It's Friday. Um, it's a day. It's the 11th of December, guys. It's Friday, I'm my Friday. dudes. Oh my god. It's Friday, my dudes. Uh... It's the 11th. <laughs> um, <laughs> happy Fry. Happy Fry. Yay. Some might say Fry. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> no, they don't. No, they don't. <laughs> Poggers for Friday. Poggers for Friday. I have no idea wow. if this is all working on stream, by the way, because I'm like, you know, yeah. Wow. Welcome to J Jingle Jam Yogg's Cast. I'm Kim. Welcome. I'm I'm Kim. Uh, that one, I think. I don't know which way I'm pointing. One of these is Rhiannon, and the other one Hello. is Tom Hazel. Hello. We Hi. are your hosts for this morning for a non-stop thrill ride from 11 to 2 p.m. You got us. We're, we're here. We're here. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone else is busy playing cyberpunk. Um, so you got us. Yes, they are, Kim. <laughs> On you. Tom Hazel, Hello. why didn't you explain the look on your face right now? <laughs> well, why I'm so tired? Maybe because I've been staying up until 4.30 to 5 a.m. the last couple of days playing cyberpunk. Yeah, uh, which is which is why I want I want I want people to be donating to their favorite charities, getting a load of games to make this all worth my while. Or I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I would like everyone to know the um, I, I want I want you guys to know some behind the scenes information on how when I initially texted these two chaos twins and said, hey, guys, do you want to come do stocking stuffers with me? Because I'm lonely and I don't want to do it myself. And um, Tom was like, yeah, sure, bud. That's fine. A week later, he, he calls me up on the discord and he goes, Kim Richards, I have words for you. I have a I have bone bones. to pick. You specifically, <laughs> I have a bone to pick with you. Do you realize the day? Kim Richards, I have a giant bone <laughs> exactly. to pick with you. <laughs> exactly. I was mildly <laughs> scared for a minute. <laughs> and then he shouldn't have delayed. A weird hesitation. <laughs> I know, right? Um, but yeah, and the bone he had to pick with me is the cyberpunk came out yesterday and Tommy Hazel booked two days off this year. He's been working all year round. He's only yep. taken two days of holiday, and those two days were yesterday and today. And look and where I'm here he is today. now. I'm here today, so I'm hoping that today we will reach 2,077,000. Yep. Or I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> or it's cancelled. Charity <laughs> is cancelled, and he yeah. wants another day off. <laughs> That's the goal. Oh, my God. <laughs> So what are we doing here today, everybody? What are we doing? You, uh, you, you go. What you speak now? Oh, we're playing some wonderful games that you can get right now in the gad dang bundle. Jinglejam.tiltify.com. You can get some awesome games. Probably the best bundle we've ever had, and we're going to be playing some of them today. We've got yep. Sunless Sea, Sunless which is. <laughs> Uh, Kim is going to be playing that one. We're going to be playing Transistor. Uh, I think a couple of days ago, if you watched the Hades stream, it's made by those guys. Uh, yeah. Middle finger is what I'm counting on there. <laughs> um, That's it. So Flip the children off. <laughs> yeah. Um, and lastly, we're going to play... Uh, well, not lastly. We're doing them in a different order. I don't know why I said it in that order. But we're going to play um, Dungeon of... Nullberg. <laughs> <laughs> Now, <laughs> we're having a bit of debate as to how this game is pronounced. Um, so this game, uh, Dungeon of Nickelback, isn't actually in the bundle, but the publishers um, have made some of the games that are in the bundle. Yeah. But also, it is the perfect game for us, the h half the high rollers, well, 1.5, no, uh, 55, I don't know. However many percent, no, we are half, there's six of us. Yeah. I've gone mad. Mm. <laughs> I've gone yeah. mad. Um, but yes, have. Don't worry. Um, there's a reason we want to play uh, Dungeon of Nickelback because um, I think you'll see. When we get around, it'll be the second game we play today. Um, and you'll see why we like it. It's not actually called the Dungeon of Nickelback. It's called the Dungeon of Nahul Book. 
But we're having apparently, a lot of debate it, as to how apparently it's Apparently it's a, uh, it's the French pronunciation. Uh, oh my god. What? Oh my god, it is. It's a French pronunciation, so it's... Nuhulbeer. 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 Dungeon of Nuhulbeer. How dare you? I watched that episode of The Simpsons recently, and my God, it's actually quite violent. I don't, I don't know if you realise, children, but The Simpsons is actually quite a violent cartoon. Is it? Like, there's a lot of murder in that episode. There's like a lot remember. of murder a lot of murder oh. is i don't know if children should really be watching the simpsons yeah i mean every um, episode they kill kenny <laughs> <laughs> oh no <laughs> oh <laughs> Nigel says she's cancelling the stream. Just cancel it. We're done. Turn it off. <laughs> that's it. Okay, that's been nine minutes, guys. We peaked. Um, we're going to go back to the rebroadcast oh, and they subscribe. Bye. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye, everybody. By the way, is all the sound and everything okay in this stream? Because I'm running things behind the scenes. And I don't know if anyone knows because, you know, a lot of people don't realize I stream anymore. Like, I've been streaming back for a year, but people are still like, oh, my God. Kim's anyway, um, my streams are a shit show. Um, and uh, it's all a technical disaster. I screw things up on a regular basis. So being on the main channel, let me in I'll let you in on a secret, guys. I was actually really nervous about doing this. Because I'm on the main channel, I've got to be vaguely professional. And Kim. um here's Kim. here's <laughs> Kim. Kim. Stop. Kim. Don't Kim. worry about Kim. it. You got this Kim. girl. <laughs> well, girl. Can I let you in on a little secret, guys, of, as to how well my morning is going? Full of pee pee poo poo? Uh oh, no. God. Um <laughs> Well, <laughs> yes, but I did do my toilet time earlier. Thank you, Tom, for asking. Um uh. It's more that um my top is on backwards. Oh, okay. This is actually oh. the back of my top. This this is the front of my top. Um, oh man. Yeah. Oh. That. Yeah. The the label. Yeah. That. There, there's the. <coughs> there's the label. <laughs> wow. -y. Um. So. Oh. It's all good. I wouldn't have known unless you pointed it out. So. Yeah. Well, but now you've pointed know. it out. And yeah. Now we all know. <laughs> so there we go. That's um. No longer a secret. <laughs> please donate to charity so this poor. Old woman oh. can, can go to her retirement home and get a helper yeah. to dress her. Um. <laughs> for, the, for the Kim, Mary Kimbus. Mary Kimbus. Mary Kimbus, Mary Kimbus to all. Yeah. To all a good Kimbus. If you don't know that, one of the charities actually for the Jingle Jam is for me to get help, um, get get a yeah. helper to like you know care for me. It doesn't get need much. It doesn't need much. It's only like three pound, but she yeah. just won't do it. <laughs> <laughs> So if everyone donates three pounds, we can fix a Kimbus for Christmas. Yeah. Fix the Kimbus. But fix the Kimbus and, and get her as someone who can dress her in the morning. I mean, to be honest, Ted does that sometimes. When I refuse to get out of bed, he just throws clothes on me and then puts my socks on. What a loving Aww. human being. <laughs> <laughs> sure. <laughs> what, don't your partners do that for you? Put socks on your feet in the morning? No, I'm competent. I mean, oh you're many things, Tom Hazel, but I'm not entirely sure competent <laughs> is the word that I would use. Uh, Kim, hang on a second. Just let me just check where my label oh, is. Oh, <laughs> weird. <laughs> Here comes the roast sesh, guys. Here we go. Right, how are you doing, Marie, this morning? How's it all going? You having a great morning? I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. I got up, I got up at like eight this morning, which is rare for me. <laughs> I'll be, I'll be honest. Rare I get up that early. Yeah, I'm, I'm here. I did it. <laughs> Can you hear that? Right, Can you hear that weird noise in the background? Oh, um... please and go. I can't wear <laughs> weird. It's, it's a bit weird, but like I don't know. It's like a really <laughs> high whining noise, like a really high pitched yeah. whine. I think it's my <laughs> boiler. I think I've got some like weird pipes oh, going okay. on. Okay, you might want to sort that out. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh no, it's just oh. Tom's oh, there he is. <laughs> there he is. I'm out. Hooray. That's a horrible noise. I Hello. Know. 
He's free. He's free now. He's free. Right, before we got uh, started on Sunless Sea, do you have something to say, Tom? Are you you just gesturing? Uh, no, that was my that was my engage. Okay, engage. Right. Okay. Business. We're here for charity, kids. You know what the Jingle yes. Jam is. We're here to raise lots and lots and lots and lots of money. We are currently on that. <laughs> Dyslexic Kim can't read numbers bigger than 10. Um, 1.68 <coughs> million? Yeah. So we want to be on, well, Tom wants to be on 2 million zero seven 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 seven. Um, but yeah, can, can we do it. can we get to two point six eight five by the Raise end it. of the stream? Can we can we do that? What what's the, the, the donate at jinglejam dot tiltify dot com? And if you donate over twenty five pounds, Tom, you've got to raise it. Raise Tom. your arms, Tom. Raise it, please, Tom. Yeah, you've got T Rex arms, but raise it. Um, I, uh, yeah, so I know I, I, if you donate £25 or more, you get a whole bundle of games, um, including the games that we are going to play today. And there's a whole bunch of charities, a, a, a bunch of bleeding charities that all this money goes towards. So you can fund, well, we've, we've actually already hit a, a bunch of targets, haven't we? Um, so Yogg's Cast has already funded a new state of the art facility at the Bristol Children's Hospital. Woo! We have already saved yeah. one dolphin. And one whale yeah. as well. One whale as well. We have also funded ten advanced bionic hero arms for ten amputees with the Open Bionics Foundation. Woo! Incredible. Um, and we are very, very close. We're very close on War Children. Um, we are very, very close to hitting the uh, two hundred thousand pound target on that. Um, and also uh, Games Workshops. Uh, so the National Video Game uh, Museum. They want to uh, fund Games Workshops to help disadvantaged school children tackle their mental health. So that's very close to being funded as well. The project, um, if if you were to fund, because uh, you can send your donation to a specific charity. It doesn't have to be to all of them. But if you want to fund a specific charity, my charity of choice is 125. Um, 125 are a very important charity based in Bristol here um, and they basically help uh, street sex workers uh, get the help that they need to rehabilitate and uh, take control back of their lives and why that's important is that these women are often victims of abuse um, sexual assault um, domestic abuse a lot of them were uh, you know uh, have stories of being abused as a, ch a child and 125 help them and the money that we are the project we're raising money for with the jingle jam today <coughs> is to fund their drop-in center for a whole year and these drop-in centers are very valuable because they're a place that's open 24 hours a day that women can come in they can get a hot calorific meal a, a healthy nutritious meal they can get you know a, a place to sleep for the night they can get legal help they can get all kinds of help um to basically get their lives back on track and to help and to start healing um, they can get therapy. They can get counselling. They can get. They can. It's a place for empathy, basically empathy and support. So if you were to uh, throw your money at one specific cause today, I'd ask you to throw it at one twenty-five um, because I think they're a very important charity um, and they do lots and lots of amazing um, empathetic work. Um, you too. Have you got any specific charity you'd like to plead the case for? Yeah, sure. Uh, special Effect, which is planning to fund two brand new games with the eye gaze. I don't know if you watched the uh, Vidya Game Awards yesterday, but there was a, they've started a whole new award section for games, uh, accessibility within games. Uh, so uh, there was things like Assassin's Creed, which had um, different options, uh, sound subtitling, so you can see the direction of them, so anyone hard of hearing can play their games without any worries. And uh, Last of Us has these wild things that I would never have thought of <laughs> to make their games playable by everybody. And things like funding two brand new games with eye gaze means that anyone, anywhere, any when, whoever they are, um, can play games and experience the joy that they bring to everybody. And that's something I think is very cool. Everyone should be playing games, no matter <laughs> what. And, uh, and the special effect of planning on making some games with the eye gaze. So there's my one. That's your one. Rhiannon, what, what have you got? Uh, mine would be um, Access Sport. So um, mm. they make sure that nobody gets excluded from exercise. Exercise should be available to everybody, mm -hmm. no matter what your abilities are. And uh, they make sure that uh, kids with, uh, yeah, 
kids uh, that are disadvantaged you get uh, the opportunity to partake in community sports. So, well, there you go. Very so good. those those are our three chosen char our three the charities that we are championing today. Of course, you know. Just donate. And it doesn't have to be what's wrong, Tom Hazel. <laughs> so, <laughs> Braldi has said everyone should be playing games, even if they don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> Play don't want to. So, so, Tom, your charity is basically you just want to be funded so you can go around and shout at everyone, play this game. Like, play Cyberpunk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Um, you don't have to donate £25. £25 or more is if you want the games in the bundle. Um, obviously, a pound, one pound is good enough. Um, hmm. uh, yeah, so any anything you, you can donate, um, yeah, you know what to do. Go and do it. Do the thing. Yeah. Right. It's probably time that we actually play, on that note of play the goddamn game, we should probably pl play the goddamn game. Um, play the GD game. Heck play it. the GD Heck. game, yo. Play the um, game. What are you playing? We are playing the first game that we are going to play is Sunless Sea. If I can get the right window up, there we go. Um, so Sunless Sea, this is available in the um, the bundle, and <laughs> it's a really hard game, everybody. It's really don't worry hard. about it, Kim. You got the pros with you. That's me and Re. We're the pros. We're going to help We're you through pros. the game. Don't we, worry about it. Forget about it. You're struggling in the sea? We'll get you out of the sea. Put you on <laughs> land. That's where you'll live, okay? You got it. Don't got worry. It. Forget about it. it. Anyway. Carry so on. So this stream is over. Um. <laughs> well, come on. <laughs> come on. Come on. <laughs> Come on! Oh my god. So if anyone's uh, been watching the Jingle Jam, I don't know if any of you have been, um, but you may have seen my little sting on like why this is my favourite game in the bundle. Um, it's a great game. It's a hard game. You can eat your own crewmates in this game. And I want to do Whoa. a playthrough play yes! where Spine we end up. up eating our... Yes! <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> right there, Tom. That's the most excited Sorry. I've seen you. In a long time. Love me a bit of vor, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Loved it. <laughs> anyway. Not quite vor, but sure. This isn't a dreamer casual cannibal. <laughs> <laughs> we can be a casual cannibal. So um, basically, it's it's an RPG, um, text-based RPG, story in it. Mwah. Basically, London fucked. Um, it's underwater. Um, the whole world underwater fucked. Um, and we need to go and explore. And make our way, and the sea is unforgiving. Oh. Hmm? No, mm -hmm. carry on. Bad it's joke. Fine. Carry on. Bad joke. Um, so I need you guys to help me because we we need to choose various RPG options to first of all to kind of basically set the scene, who we are as a human being, or are we human beings even, um, as a captain of the ship. Um, so we begin in the ra three decades ago in the reign of Victoria. London was stolen by <laughs> bats. Now it lies <laughs> under a mile below the surface. Um, it was dreadfully un inconvenient for everybody, but it opened the vast black ocean to you. Welcome to the undersea. Untersee. 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 Um, so we're going to decide who we are. Yeah. Um, we are currently living uh, lodging in London. Would we like to be a street urchin, uh, which gives Ooh. bonuses to veils, which is... So we've got basically... We've got various RPG stats up here. We've got iron, which is basically fighting. Um, so that's mm. strength, basically. Um, mirrors, which is deception, uh, detection and perception. Um, okay. we got veils, which is speed, stealth, deception. Pages, which is knowledge, so intelligence, wisdom, that kind of thing. Um, and we've got hearts, which is inspire, heal, and defend. Um, mm, so if we go okay. street urchin, we can uh, boost our veils, which is subtlety and evasion. If we're a poet, um, that's trickery and knowledge. Uh, if we're a veteran, uh, that is iron. So the, the destroy. I, I love that the flavor text for this is destroy. Um, yeah. If we're an ordained priest, I'm an ordained minister, y'all. Um, then we get hearts. Uh, and if we're a natural philosopher, that is mirrors, which is detection and perception. So what are you guys feeling this morning? What What are you feeling that you mm, want to be? Uh, I do like high perception, and yeah. I am the very model of a natural philosopher. So <laughs> maybe, yeah. maybe that one. Feeling that? Re, you got you. I don't know. Do what what well? do you guys? I think Re I was feeling urchin. Urchin. Oh, okay. 
<laughs> so, yeah. Uh, so yeah, so it, either veils, which is subtly an invasion, or um, detection and perception. Uh, you are the deciding vote, Kim. Yeah, this is down to you. You've mm. played this. Uh, you, you know what? You know what's good or what's bad. I've played I, I don't... this, and I won't lie. We're going to die in, within the first um, ten minutes. No, 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 come on, come on, come on, give me. You're forgetting. You're forgetting who's <laughs> with you now. Yeah, it's the pro gamers. We're here to Tim help and, you. Tim and Chase. See, we got it. Don't Tim and worry. Chase. I've got Tim and Chase. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Tim philosopher. Chase. Awesome. Philosopher. Okay. Um, <laughs> yeah. So we we uh, oh we've um. We've a a blah, 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 blah. because of that, we now have we've won. So Echo. We've won. Um, oh. Echo is money, so we now have seventy Ooh, monies. Well um, we've also <gasps> gained twenty-five mirrors. Uh, we also have a plausible surgeon who wants to join our crew. Um, so that's what we want to do. Right. You also said someone is looking for passage as well. What, what does uh, that yeah, mean? Yeah, we'll we'll get to that one in a second. Um, okay. We okay. still have to finish who we are as a captain. Well. So. <laughs> no, a private kingdom. Uh, unfortunately, we can't do that. Ooh. That's a later game um, thing that we, we can unlock. Um, oh, a higher difficulty. Okay. Tom's yes. locked. Pro so, gamer skills is locked. So do you want... Uh, <laughs> is your goal in life wealth, fulfillment, or your dad's bones? Dad's bones? Dad's bones. <laughs> dad's bones? Dad's bones. Dad's bones. Okay. Dad's so we bones. Were... Dad's bones. <laughs> your father was lost at sea. You never, you never knew him, but you've often dreamed of him. Find and, uh, find and return his remains to London for a decent burial. Um, so we've got for that. Okay, so that's who we are. Now, do you want to be referred to as Madam, My Lord. Sir, <laughs> My Lord, My Lady, or Captain? Ooh, ah, oh, Captain, My Captain. Oh, captain's not an good. Captain. Yeah. Captain, you can't go wrong with Captain, My Captain, right? Captain, yeah. My Captain. Um, so, yeah, uh, I'm just going to choose the one with the most tentacles. There we go. Yeah. Horatio Vanderbrook. <laughs> wow. Straight captain. in. Shaz Tim, Horatio <laughs> Thunderbuck. Sh Horatio yeah. Thunderbuck. Okay. Wait, no, I've called it Horatio. No, I like Horatio. <laughs> kind of sounds like uh, kind of sounds like Battlestar when you do it that way. Right, <gasps> because Dad's bones. Oh, oh this bones. is bones. There's hey, bones. Awesome. There they are. We've got As I live and breathe. That's a picture of them. We. That's a As I live and breathe. And that's he not them. <laughs> so basically. Yeah, uh, it, is said, bones. <laughs> it is said that she controls half the crime in London. It is said that she is 500 years old. It is said that she can distill spirits that delight the tongue and melt the flesh. It is said that she has paid for a memorial headstone to be set up for your father. What does she know? Um, so basically, she I am hasn't seen my dad's bones. <laughs> <laughs> I am going to skip. Full of calcium. I'm going to skip a lot of the text because there is a lot of text to get through and we're never going to start this game otherwise because I want to show you I want to go I want to go to C basically. Um Okay. So we're in London, we're in fallen London. Um there's various things we can do. Um we can go to our lodgings and I will do that actually because one easy bit of thing that you can do to start with is read the morning papers uh and that will okay. give us uh, a nugget of recent news. So uh -huh. as we're kind of traveling the sea and we find settlements and we find curiosities you can basically trade and gain things through, I guess, trade of information, mostly. Um, so doing kind of things like this, like reading the morning papers, is a very easy way to get recent news. Um, and okay. also one supply, because this is a resource management game. And the two things we need are fuel and supplies. Um, and they are very hard to come by. Um, so there's nothing else we can do really at our lodgings. Um, right, sure. a passenger. Okay. Okay. <gasps> An eye. Aye, aye, Captain. So, so we have... Uh, <laughs> do we want to take on board uh, this passenger? Uh, August travel writer the, to Gader's Morn. So we have to find Gader's Morn and take him there. What's the symbol next to go? Uh, it is like a little... It's, a, it's, it's oh, kind okay. of like a symbol for your journal. So it's kind of like... It's, yeah, yeah. Uh, do, do wh where is logo? Gader's Morn? Ah, a good question, Thomas Hazel. Ooh. What? Wait, do we Let's not know? We don't Let's know. take the boy. Oh, Let's take him. <laughs> yeah, sure. We'll He's going to eat all our food. God damn it! I know. <laughs> um, so We're going to eat him. <laughs> yeah. That's the thing. We can eat him. So these are all the kind of like you know the little images that you've been seeing. Um, these are the kind of things like that we can collect. Think of it almost oh. like a board game, you know. Um, and okay. then this That's is a nice our way officer. to keep track of the story. Yeah, this is our officer oh, that we picked that up. 
Um, hang on. He is hang on. A... Hang on. Sorry. Hang on. What's our ma what's mascot? <gasps> Hold on. Let me just uh, talk to him about his uh, dreams and ambitions. He wants. Uh... Oh no! Fuck your dreams and ambitions. I saw a weird rat thing. <laughs> Where's the dare Show me the rat. It's Where's not a weird rat? rat. It's a comatose ferret. Why is it comatose? Oh, look at the rat. It oh. lies oh. across your desk like a lumpy scarf. It's a comatose ferret. Speak Play with it. my ferret, okay? Yeah. A weary roll of the eye. Play, that eye roll says. Play. I played once in the happy Warrens of London before you installed me in this floating coffin and made me eat dried food. Damn your play. It is an eloquent eye roll. Oh, he knows. There's a lot of emotion in that eye roll. I feel this when, when Milo looks at me and mm. rolls his eyes. This is what I feel. Um, <laughs> he was I like this me in this floating coffin. <laughs> He's yeah. got muck. I'll give him that. So our, our He's got spunk. <laughs> <laughs> our spunky comatose ferret gives us one heart. Um, so, okay. Yeah. So, so All right. Now that. we can find out about the life dreams and goals of a uh, oh surgeon. i've already i've already accepted his quest oh, okay um, so fine. don't worry about it so it's something about finding something or other um so yeah so ah, who cares it's only his dreams <laughs> this is our ship that we can upgrade uh this is how we can upgrade it but we can't do shit right now because we've got yeah. no money whatsoever um so how about we begin our let's get floating let's get floating shall we go. so what do you want to call our ship the spunky um, ferret the spunky, the spunky ferret. ferret. Yeah. The spunky comatose <laughs> ferret. The, spunky the SCF. Oh, yeah. The USS SCF. <laughs> USS? USS -CF. Wait, what's USS? Um, US, US, United States Space. something. I only know NCC, NCC 1701, Class D. Um, shut up. Um, so <laughs> That's the Enterprise. Yeah, the Enterprise, but it's, it's, it's the, the D and the E is the one in the generation. Sh and, uh, <laughs> oh, USB. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I think you'll find <laughs> Oh, we found Bad Steven as Abyss. Yeah, <gasps> Bad oh. Steven as Abyss. Um, so the sea is treacherous and it hates us. Oh, what um, was that? that? Something just flew towards us. Yeah, go. so that is our sonar. So this Z-Bat is our sonar if you see it kind of flies oh. out and around oh. and then it'll find things and then but there's no there's nothing there uh, unfortunately i am covering up uh the log book in the bottom left corner here you, 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 can, you, do could, you, do, right? um, you can nudge the cameras make them smaller and i move could it up do that tom yeah anyway <laughs> okay all right <laughs> so okay. we found hunter's keep now hunter's keep is a good first place to start hunter's keep what I'm looking for, okay, so I'm looking for um, over here. There's like a light patch of uh, water over here. So I want to I wanna basically aim for that to dock. So we've got oh, various okay. stats. Things that you need to keep an eye on are the bars up here. So the blue one is fuel. The red one is food. Uh, and this one is terror. So kind of like, I guess, Call of Cthulhu and those sorts of games. Terror, right. the, the more terrified we get, the bad things well not necessarily bad the interesting things happen what's there to be scared of the sea it's like phasmophobia the sea the lassophobia the lassophobia <gasps> exactly oh. right so welcome to our first island it's hunter's keep very cool. okay um, so a hump of dark rock swathed in mist like a hundred other unter z islands but here's a grand house windows aglow lawns impossibly green haunted and lush in the false starlight Raked Haunted. gravel paths. It's very like D and D, isn't this? Yeah, it's a little bit. Um, you set the what, scene for you. Um, what right. options? Present yourself. Walk in the gardens. Uh, and reconnoiter uh, the island. Uh, we could also spy on the house. Now, if we spy on the house, this oh. is a challenge. And so very so. Yeah. Like in D&D, when you get to various areas, there are things that you can do that are like different challenge ratings. So if you want to do something sneaky, it could work, but um, y y it, y you have to roll a challenge for it. So because we've got good veils, um, we've got a 75% oh, okay. chance of succeeding on this. However, I have just noticed that someone has donated a thousand pounds. So I think we need to yeah. take a little pause. Uh, if one of you two little munchkins could pause for a second and, and read that out on the donation reader. I shall. That was from Recall. <gasps> Thank you very much, oh, Recall. 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 Oh, Recall. Once again. Yeah, yeah, nothing sweetheart. better on this sunless Friday morning than 50% more chaos. Great work, folks. Keep up the great work. 
Thanks oh, thank you us. very much, Recall. Thank you so much. Recall. We've also had uh, Dactite, oh Ace of Thorns, Psycho Giant, Flower, Lucolo, George D, Night Jim, Sam Skywalker, Stephen, Lorf, Festive Biscuit, and Mini Noises have donated as well. Thank you so much. For all your thank you very much, well. everybody. Yeah, boy. Oh, yeah, boy. Really Recall's such a sweetheart. And Recall has been dropping the big donos all jingle jam. Don't think we haven't seen you, Recall. Yeah. Um, we've yeah. seen you. We, we've seen you. We've seen Thank We're you no so strangers much. to recall either. Um, yeah. You know, you the, know rules. the rules. So do We're I. No stra- yeah. <laughs> we kind of got there, but at different, yeah. different times. Well, I was, so I was going <laughs> to say, Spying on the House has a high chance of success. However, I don't think a game has ever let me live out my dream of reconnoitering islands. Okay. Um, nah, nah, nah. Do the spying. Spying? What are these? What, so what, what, again, what are these icons next to the so, go button here? Um, so so if we with... go back to journal, um, they kind of come up here um, as things that we can trade, objectives that we can complete. Um, oh no, so I mean, it's, it's... do they do they oh, say sorry. a potential like result that we could get for it? Um, so uh, it, if we if we do present yourself at the house, we can unlock acquaintance uh, sojourning at the sisters. Right. Okay. Um, <clears> if we spy. Um, it's various levels of, of things. It kind of, it, it doesn't tell you everything because it's like, it, it wants to keep a little bit of mystique, you know? I do, right. do We're going to spy. We're going to spy. Yeah, um, I mean, there's a percentage yeah. chance. Yeah. So, piano music drifts across the terrace. You peer through a half-open French window into a grand parlour, grand in size, if a little reduced in style by dust and neglect. A dark-haired, pale-skinned young woman bends earnestly over a piano keyboard. Another, fair-haired but unmistakably her sister, sprawls on the sofa with a book. A third sits by the fireplace, staring sorrowfully into the embers. Soon, she says, and the piano music falters and stops. We'll go hungry, and then the end will come. For me, but not for you. The pianist raises her eyes from the keyboard. Hush! If we don't speak of it, she frowns. Has she seen you at the window? You withdraw. Um, we succeeded, though. Uh, we succeeded. Nice. Um, we know something of Hunter's Keep. Um, so we know to get the hell out of here. Knowledge is a good currency in, in this world. Um, we've also gained uh, 40 fragments, new total of 140. So fragments turn into awesome. secrets, and secrets are things that we can barter. Um, so Very cool. What okay. do we want to do now? Do you want to reconnoiter the island or present yourself at the house? Oh, so our options have changed. Well, they've reduced. Um, so now that we know that, does that give us extra bonuses in future, like dialogues or? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it can okay. change things. It can change things. Um, the other thing is, like I said, this game is hard. Um, so it's a, it's essentially kind of like a resource management game matched with sort of intrigue and mystery. Um, I mean, I'm the creepy ghost now. lady. So Go I'm, I'm going to tell you now because uh, you might want to keep this in mind. This game, you will die a lot in it, and you'll have to reset and go back. But things that you discover Perfect. in each playthrough can uh, transfer over to your new captain. So if you really? unlock oh. certain things, travel certain areas, you can bring that back and give, like, it's called Legacy. Oh. You give that to your next captain. So the whole oh, idea, I had no is idea it's okay That's if you cool. die. It's okay if oh. you die, and you're going to die a lot. But slowly, 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 you increase, 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 and get further and further and further. And Tom's I there. had no idea. That's I really had no cool. idea. That's so cool. Sorry, I should have told you that to start with. Uh, so, oh. um, as it says in the tutorial, captains often die. This is not the end. When you die, you'll learn lessons which help you survive until next time. Um, but the, So, the map changes, but um, certain things will like transfer over to your new, uh, your new captain. Um, so, future awesome. captains can inherit awesome. some skills, officers, equipment, and money. So, officers can transfer over, um, various skills can transfer over, items can transfer over. Um, it's kind of called legacy and inheritance. So, um, awesome. yeah. So, that, that's. Okay. That's well, okay. in that case, let's just go balls to the wall. Let's interrogate these ghosts. She already said that it's the end for her, but not for me. Wait, no, they were talking to each other, weren't they? Um, yeah. I'm gonna go, we're we're going to go talk to them. We're going to go talk to them. Okay. So yeah. we knock and Jin enter. Uh, a maid with smouldering topaz eyes shows you into the parlour where three young women wait. A visitor, the youngest cries. The next youngest chuckles. The eldest sighs. Do excuse the indecorum. Visitors are rare. You are very welcome. I am Cynthia. The noisy one is Phoebe and the cheerful one is Lucy. You are in good time for lunch. Uh, lunch. Will you join us? 
Um, no. So we're going to join them. Who do you yeah. want to lunch with? So we can get the Cynthia, who's the oldest. She's melancholy, pensive, and occasionally dramatic. We can uh, lunch with Lucy, who's the middle sister. Sunny, restless, and prone to giggles. Or we could lunch with Phoebe, who is soft-voiced, watchful, and unpredictable. We could also, if we had uh, recent news and a few other things, we could uh, basically... Uh, so once once we talk to them... They're going to disappear. But if we want to lure them out again, we lure them with the promise of recent news, which we picked up in the docks oh. at the beginning right. of the Right. Okay. Okay. Ooh. I see. Hmm. Does, does recent news over time degrade into nope. just... Nope. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Um, Who do you want to lunch man, with? I don't know. Hmm. Cynthia? Old one? Yeah. yeah. So melancholy, pensive, and occasionally dramatic. I'm click sure, this will be fun. Yeah. Cynthia grasps your arm and whispers to you. Her eyes are wild and blue. Uh, are wide and blue. Her hair is wild and tangled. Bats might nest in it. It seems to you that you are sitting on a hillside above a wide blue lake, listening to the story of a murder, an axe, a Ooh. net, blood on scented water. Another chop? Cynthia asks. You barely touch your food. Here, I'll have the maid wrap something up for you. You can't be hungry. It's not safe to be hungry. So. In talking to her, um, we now have uh, some terror. So our terror bar went up. Um, we also have a tale of terror. Um, and we've gained one supply, which is good. Um, and we are acquainted with the sisters. We've lost hunger as well, which is good. Um, and we oh. also now have the gods of the Z salt's attention. Um, that um. will come back later. Don't worry about that. Right. That, that seemed worry. pretty good. Yeah. Other cool. than the terror. <laughs> yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna reconnoitre the island as well. Um, so oh, we've got news thing, now. Yeah, another no. thing that we can do is every port that you pop in on, if you reconnoitre around it, you can uh, write a report on it. Go back to London, and there's a, an officer that you can hand these reports to in there that gives you resources ah. and stuff like that. Um, okay, which is very so cool. useful. Um, so yeah, so, so that's pretty much all we can do so, on this. So how have we unlocked? How have we unlocked the news news thing? Yes. Um, I'm uh, not going to do it now because um, I don't think we need it because we're pretty good for resources. So this Hunter's Keep is basically a very good starter island to go to because it's a very nice, gentle start. Um, right. I want to keep the recent news for when things go tits and we might need some food. <laughs> sure. Okay, cool. So. Yeah, let's get let's get moving. We still haven't found, uh, I can't remember the name of the. Um, Gators, ga Gators, something or other. Um, Gators going to gate. Gators going to gate. Um, so we'll we'll set out. So yeah. Um, so that's kind of like the gist of the game, basically. Is that, and it's one of the reasons I love it for the weird stories, because there are some yeah. really weird stories here. Yeah. Um, it 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 is hard though, but it's okay. It's you die, you come back. You know, you live, you die, oh, you live again. What's right. happening? Oh, we oh my god! Oh my god! Bats! That's okay. warm. Ah. Oh. So, don't worry about it. Don't Fire! Worry. I got it. Fire! Bang! Ooh, oh god. my god! So oh, they're coming cool. for us. So I'm just you just shot a my... bat with a cannon? That's an amazing shot. Yeah. So there's there combat go. in this as well. Um, oh, is there more? Who's that? Who's that? Shoot him. Over there. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I'm not going to. It's a pirate ship. Um, Shoot so him. Acquired. Hold on. Uh, oh, what would you like to do with the bat swarm we just blew out of the water? Would you <gasps> like Ooh. to eat them? Gavin. Well, eat, disposing I'm... gets rid of the terror that we've just gained. But Thomas, oh. don't you want to go slightly mad? Yes. We'll feed ourselves. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Those little bones are oh. troublesome. Mm. <laughs> but we, yummy, have, yummy. we have gained terror in doing that. But that's fine. Um, I'm going to avoid the pirate ship for now because I don't want to get okay. blown up immediately. So our oh. whole, this is our whole um, health over here. Uh, uh, I want right. to, I want to keep exploring um, and do that. Nice. Okay. Um, so, yeah. Does wanna... toggling the lights have any gameplay effect? Can you stealth with it? So it makes you more visible. So things like pirate ships and stuff like that can come and find you uh, quite easily. Um, so okay. yeah, like you said, stealth. Um, but also if we keep it on, that slows down Ooh. the amount of terror that we receive. Land ho! Lighthouse, yeah. dead ahead. So I'm not sure. So this is Tanachuk. And we've also discovered the Hornman Stag. So that's Horn and Stag. Oh. There. I, unfortunately, I can't see a docking area, so I'm not sure we can dock there just yet. 
Um, okay. But yeah, so it would be uh, a lighter patch of blue. Um, oh, cool. Right. Yeah. Uh, so let's look at the um, map. But it's still not... How big is the map? Um, oh, oh wow. yikes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Cute. All right. So it, I think it will take several playthroughs to explore the whole map because you're going to have to upgrade your ship by bigger engines, um, you know, that kind of thing. And that will take time because, like, one thing you need to accrue really is money. So at the moment, we've got 70 monies. Um, and, like, the first ship upgrade is 1,000 monies. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's going to take a while. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay, cool. So well, I don't I know. You might, have a, you might have a quest comes up that's just like... Hey, I'm a crazy old ghost in this village, and I'm gonna give you four thousand gold. <laughs> Maybe. And that's how you win. Maybe. Uh, There's lots it's of, um... okay. We know where it is, me and Re. <laughs> we know. <laughs> we, we know, know this game. There's <laughs> lots of krakens and stuff as well. Kraken okay, shots. I take it back. We're fucked. <laughs> <laughs> run away, run away as fast as you can. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, oh, so where we do where we docking, boys? So this is Vanderbite. Oh, I like oh, this. Sweet. What a cool name. Right. So this is the tomb colony of Vanderbite. Nice. Oh. Um, so this is really cool. This is right up Ree Street. So basically, this mm. is a colony of dead people, um, <laughs> mummies, and that. Uh, so on deck, you can hear the sound that a thousand bandaged dead make as they shuffle and cough. It's something like the world's most restless concert audience or the world's most plague-ridden cathedral. Um, so cool. there's various things we can do here. So uh, first thing is uh, basic exploration. So uh, the citizens of Vanderbilt are called tomb colonists. Um, oh. So here they favor candlelight over gaslight. The shadows are swagged like cobwebs. The tomb colonists stand still enough to be mistaken for sculpture until they laugh or cough. One building and three seems abandoned. Oh, hello. Oh, um, oh hello. A little chapel stands alone. You poke your head through the door. The walls are deep, uh, are deep red, just this side of scarlet. A ruby-tinted window at the back glows with a steady light. An electric lamp behind the glass. Rare and expensive, but this is no gaslight. Um, what can you find? So Very a straightforward cool. challenge... Ba, 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 ba. Yeah, do that. Ninety nine percent. Make an offering. We can make an offering as well. Um, but let's do let's do the first one. Eight straightforward challenge. Yeah. And hungred. Okay. Uh, there is an altar, a block of basalt. There are pews, a pulpit. No Bibles, no hymn books. The stained glass window uh, is red of the cocknel. Um, an inscription on the lintel of the door reads, "For I was an hungered, and ye gave me meat." That is all. Um, we've gained a fragment, we've gained terror, and that is all for nice. now. Nice. Gained terror, perfect. Very cool. Whoa. Um, oh. I love oh, this. No. Oh, that was spooky. Descriptions are so cool. Yeah. The writing's really good. Yeah. 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 Re I, I, it's another thing. It was another reason why I love this game is like I just love the atmosphere, like the the kind yeah. of universe, the story building, the world building. I want to get. Um, I want to get all up in Anne Hungred. You want to get up in Anne Hungred. Um, I think yeah. as well, since, since this game has come out, um, there's also, um, I can't remember what it's called, but they've done this, but in the skies. So like in, up, up in the air. Sunless skies. That, I think it is I think it is called something like that. Um, but yeah, right? I haven't played that one yet. Um, but yeah, we're going to talk to the curator. Yeah, it actually is. <laughs> it, uh, yeah, it is. Um, yeah. um, let's, what does, uh, so we've talked to a creator and they want, uh, they want colours. They want seven colours. And he's calling us uh -huh. Silkskin as well. <laughs> hey, Silkskin. <laughs> There's a going, Silkskin. <laughs> it's like Fallout. <laughs> yeah. So we'll, we'll accept this. So th we basically picked up a new quest. Um, so we need to find all of these colours. Tell you now, we're not going to do this in our first playthrough. Um, no, but yeah, so we can gather gossip as well. Um, I'm just gonna zip Gather through away. these, like just because I I want I want to drive us mad and I wanna I wanna like drive us insane. Yeah, um, oh, yeah, cool. go for it. There's also a few shops find... as well. So various so ports as well have colors? shops and things. Um, it's a it's a quest basically. Um, I you you kind of find it through exploration and other quests right. and, and 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 trading and things like that. Um, so that all the ports as well may or may not have shops. Um, that you can resupply at. There's nothing much here. 
Um, so one of the first, depending on what background you pick up at London, one of the first passengers you can pick up is actually a tomb colonist. And oh. Oh. Like, so you can drop them off right. here, like bring them here. Um, that that colours quest line, does that carry on through Legacy as well? So like No, that won't. Um, okay. But you could pick up the items and then like that could transfer over and then you and then you can still do the quest. Like um, Right, okay. And I, and I feel like that's the way it's gonna happen. Um do you know what? Uh, you I'm can change the light. speed by the way. Yeah. Whee. Um so I think at the someone said at the top I think you can change the speed from one to two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um that's the um the engine speed. Um, so I'm right. just cruising on a little bit because, like, if you do go to, yeah, you can go faster, but your fuel goes down faster. Although yeah. that could be fun because we could do some fun things with that. Uh, I am also oh, turning it's, off the it's lights. It's not just, it's not so just game over if you uh, run out of bats. Whee! Bats! <gasps> Bat attack! Bats! There are things you can do. It's all right, Kim. Don't worry. We got you. Got this. We we got you. You just you shoot mad sky. Hey, look fine. at the bats. You see the bats in the sky? These don't seem to be aggressive bats. <laughs> Hey, they're good. Oh, wait, they're no, bad bats. They're, they're bad bats. They're, 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 they are bad, bad bats. Yeah, bad bats. <laughs> <laughs> bad bats. Oh, they coming! Boom! Nice. Boom. They, they're munching bad on my bats, hull. Bad bats. They're munching on okay. my hull. Boom! Take Dude. them down. Eat their okay, flesh. Yummy, yummy. Yummy, yummy. Easy. Let's go eat them. Go crazy. Uh, got him. Got right. him. Go eat. Thank you. Oh, we're doing very well for supplies at the moment. Um, I know, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Best next. We're going <laughs> to win. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> we're going to win. Well, we're, we're down to win. five fuel and eight, well, seven hunger. Crew has been fed. Um, we've also got 65 out of 75 hull, hullness. I'm so wholesome. Send, I'm going to say. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> oh, I hate you guys. One of us was going <laughs> to dip to that level it. to make the joke. <laughs> I thought I took one for the team, Marie. <laughs> Send the bat out. Go, go, go. Can I find a Kraken this early on? Uh, <gasps> uh, just go to the furthest reaches. Oh, there seems of, to be a little of island. The up Untersee. Here. The Untersee? Uh, yeah. Exploring <laughs> das Untersee. <gasps> oh, the mm. boss is das. Oh, yeah. Like oh, nine. I'm not das is bats. <laughs> oh, it's yeah. grosser bats. I've seen Ooh, Codex. Okay. Where is Codex? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, it's over here. They are <laughs> we'll destroy not... you! <laughs> You're right there, Tom. <laughs> sorry. It's that 4am start kind of getting to you there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's Ooh. snowy. Is that snowy or is that dusty? It looks snowy, yeah. Chapel of Light. Oh, that would be cool. Okay. Oh, cool. Go, go, go. Okay. Nah, it's no. Bum, 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 <laughs> bum, 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 we're not Stop that? floating. It's it's a big fucking crab, um, and we're not. <gasps> giant enemy crab. Yeah, it's a giant enemy crab. Hit <laughs> the weak points for massive damage. <laughs> no, we are not equipped <laughs> still with an, a giant enemy crab right now. It's a giant enemy crab. Oh. That's yeah. a freaking throwback. You line them up, Ree. You line them up, Ree. <laughs> Bam! <laughs> Chapel of Lights <laughs> sounds hilariously awful. Let's do that. Yeah. Yeah, there's a port here. Cool. Crab people, crab people. Oh, this going people. so much better than my, my recent playthrough. I died pretty much straight away. Right. It's because we're, the, we're the variable. You're, yeah, you're my, you're my good luck charms. Furtive <laughs> uh, faithful gather in the shadows between many, many candles. A bell tolls in the chapel tower. Cracked iron laughter. Beware. The aisle is full of voices. So we can eat at the, uh, uh, of the chapel's bounty. A smiling priest unlocks the door and says, uh, of the storehouse for you. Here, he says, eat, but take nothing away with you. Um, so we can eat. If we had... 
So if we'd um, eaten some of our crewmates by this point, we could have unlocked <laughs> uh, this ability, which is drinking in the well. Although the smiling priest seems somewhat sus, guys. The well drinks color. The smiling priest whispers, the well drinks dreams, and the well is always thirsty. No, I think if you read it in that way, it's always going to sound creepy. Okay, how would you read it? Can you go back up again so I can see it? Oh, yeah, sorry. Uh, there it is. Um, oh, you know, the well just drinks color, you know? The well <laughs> drinks dreams. The well's always thirsty. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Forget about it. Always wants water Forget all the time. <laughs> you won't believe what the well did yesterday. Oh, God, it fucking drank my dreams. <laughs> again? Bloody again. hell. Again. Every single night. My God. Well, I'll just keep that then to you. you got to sort him out, man. <laughs> sort him out. can't sate this well. <laughs> can't be sated. <laughs> What's it like? What's it fucking like? <laughs> Do you think it tastes like Vimto? <laughs> Uh, Ooh, yeah. What, dreams? Yeah. yeah. My dreams taste like Dr. Pepper because that's all I dream about. <laughs> uh, Mine's probably a cherry cola. Um, mm, yeah. Cherry cola. Yeah. Uh, so wait, are we, are we eating this dude's meal? So we Absolutely. can either eat the meal or um, some sort of oh. chance, uh, a chance if we attend a service. 77% <gasps> chance. But I, look. <laughs> That's what I am. Bon chance. 77. 77 is is it's more than high. three quarters, so... Oh. Unlocked hmm. with five supply. I'm suspicious about this, guys. Oh, hang on. This, this option oh, no, has been wait. unlocked. Bring your offerings. Have... Yeah. <gasps> so this could... But then... Oh, so this will leave us with one supply. We could cannibalize hmm. ourselves. Oh, and then we can just come back here and um, give our nightmares to the world. Perfect. Yeah, yeah do it. Yeah. Go. Right. Um, oh, so... yes. Here we go, here we go, here we go. <laughs> the drowned man hums tonight. His song like fish row clouds the water. We will feel him in the harps of us, and if his tune is caught, it will be raised to the sky where the bright birds pass. Hear the congregation cry out like birds, <coughs> and the cries rattle away into the rafters. I realize this isn't him speaking. And the air hangs sultry, and the gods no longer frown. At the end of the service, you leave, your lips still wet and your stomach still filled with secrets. You could grow rich on this diet if you live. Tell me so we've of gained secrets. one secret. We've lost five supplies. Oh, um, but look I... at the terror. We've gained terror. <gasps> so we're now yeah. nervous. Um, we have learnt a lesson, uh, lessons of the chapel, and we have one menaces unaccountably pe uh, peckish. We now have the cannibal taint. Oh. Yay! Oh. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, um, we oh hang on, let's just here. eat. I don't, know, I don't yeah. know if I want to, though, because like, no, I, I want to get like... full again. I want to go full on crazy. Well, we've just, mm. well, that might give us supplies, because we uh, might not eat. Oh. I don't know. Uh, so, if we had one searing enigma or more supplies, we could do another um, another service, um, or we could reject what we have learnt. Turn aside; these lessons leave a red taste in you, but it won't be easy to free yourself from that redness. Um, so, unfortunately, we don't have a searing Very enigma. Cool. Otherwise, we oh, could what a shame. Um, reject our new teachings in the, uh, in the church. Yeah, eat, eat with the priest. He might eat, he might actually wanna, give us supplies. You want to no, yeah. but we want to go create. We want to go hungry and eat each other, Tom. Well, because um, we, yeah, we, but we we've only got to, one supply. But the thing is, we need to we need to swap over to Dungeon of uh, Nihilburg soon. So okay, I want to I want to give I want to give the crowd a show. I want to show them what yeah, it's yeah, like. Yeah, all right. Okay. Yeah, okay. Okay. Hey, so what's that guy's name by the way? The what's the surgeon's the name? The surgeon's name. Uh, officers. He is, uh, he's just plausible surgeon. He's just mm. plausible. So um, mm. we can level these a guys up. A palatable name. <laughs> surgeon. We, can, we could beef these guys up as well and like level them up and, and add skills and stuff like that. Um, okay. So if we tell... Actually, yeah, let's do this. If we give him a secret... Um, oh, that makes him even juicier when the time comes. Um, mm. Oh, you can, you can shag your crewmates as well. Um, <laughs> there, ah. there, there is romance in this as well. Ah. Um, lots cool. of shagging. Um, so yeah, <laughs> we talk to him. He talks about diseases. Great. 
Um, <laughs> and that's bumped cool. up some of his stats. So there oh, we go. leveled up. Um, okay. Yeah. Wait, what? What's uh, hover over his portrait? Sorry. Oh, he gives us the. Yeah. So that's what okay. he does. That's what he helps oh, nice. do. Nice. That's um, pretty cool. The ferret. Oh, he seems a little livelier today. Oh, play with him. <gasps> oh. The ferret rises oh, from its pillow and moves to explore the cabin. It moves like a meandering stream of treacle. It noses at furniture, disdains boots. It returns to its pillow. There is nothing, it expression says. Nothing at all. Nothing for me here, mother. Aww. I think our ferret's a little depressed. I don't know what's giving that away, though. That or it's a cat. <laughs> oh, my God. It's actually it's, it's actually a, a bat. <laughs> oh, my God. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, what have I just found? Okay, so there's something over here. So we're, we're going to keep going. Um, my... Okay, I'm I'm gonna repair. Right, I've repaired the hull. Okay. Oh, you can. Do, what what did you use to do that? I used a supply. So we have no supplies, oh, kids. Oh, Kim. Oh, here we go. Oh, what? Kim. What? what are we gonna do with you? Eat you. I'm gonna eat eat you. I'm gonna <laughs> eat, eat you. I'm gonna, gonna eat you. <laughs> I'm gonna eat you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna bite you. I'm gonna norm you. <laughs> Crush him. Guys, um, if, if the rollers you. ever get themselves <laughs> in a similar situation, like maybe stay away from me, because um, I'll just be looking at your gams. Like, mm. oh, there ain't no meat on me. <laughs> oh, hello. Uh, what is this? A white z -bat. Oh, it's a giant. Oh, oh, guys, it's a bit crackly. <gasps> oh, it's a bit oh, crackly. It is. Here we go. Can we strike a deal with this friend? Can so, we? There's a white Z bat watching me up there. A Zayla has grown fretful and disobedient, reluctant to go on deck even in port. There's a white Z bat watching me up there. Salt's messenger. Salt's got its eye on me. I'll never go home again. Um, so we either order him to go up on deck. Um, Salt, one of the nameless gods that Zaylas fear. This Zayla is a conscientious man. Send him to the sick bay on pretext, a pretext of a fever, or we can shoot the fucker. Um, Seventy-five percent. Do we want to piss off an old god? Do we want to piss off an old god? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. There we go. Shot it. Shot in the eye. Yeah. Um. If the, the bloody eye. thing is frightened, your bloody crew, you bloody well settle its ash. Bang! It sees your intention. <laughs> You're only supposed to, to blow flee. the bloody Z bait up. Oh, we shot it. Your shot catches it and it falls to the deck with a broken fluttering. You cross the deck and co to collect the pale corpse, your crew are utterly silent. Um, so we exceeded. We've got 15 terror. <laughs> Salt's okay. curse lies on you now. Uh, we <gasps> yeah. had a hunting trophy, though, and we know something of the three gods, which are Stone, Swarm, and Salt. So there's that. Well, there's only two now. Only we two killed now. the god, guys. We've done it. We've done it. <laughs> um, Game one. Yeah. That destroyed god. Let's see if that has any effect on the world. <laughs> oh, this place looks um, welcoming. Look at all the runes. Oh. Giant statues. That's fine. Oh, also, is that a giant just, bat? It looks like a giant. We just destroyed yeah. a bat just outside of here. Hmm. Hey, we shot this weird fucking bat out there. Is this yours? Just like that it was God. Wing. <laughs> Avid horizon. That's God. <laughs> this is the end. Two vast winged shapes guard a gate of something like resin, smooth but uneven. Um, the color that remains when all other colors have been eaten. Ice crusts over the crack between its valves. Approach and your breath freezes. Um, the colour that remains when you mix all the Play-Doh together. Yeah. And then eat it. And then poop it out. Just green. <laughs> so we, we can explore. Uh, we can't open the gates because uh, we don't have uh, more level up stuff. Uh, we could gather intelligence, look to the stars, mm. or we can... Oh, hello. Oh, um... <gasps> oh, we heard a story. We heard, heard a rumor. A story. Yeah. Uh, so this is unlocked with no more than a hunter's eye and seventy-seven fragments. Okay. What What do you guys want to do? So looking into the stars uh, is tied into terror. Unlocked with terror, no more than seventy-five. So because oh, we're not we actually insane, under. Okay. Yeah, we can look. At, we can do that one. So what Ooh. do you guys fancy? Uh, a little walk I along think, the beach, or I think looking at the stars might we might see something because we're not insane. Okay. Like maybe something will appears. reveal itself. Yes, it did. 
Look oh yeah, we, we're even more terrified now. Um, yeah. These are real stars. They burn above the roof of the Neath, beyond the earth, in the spaces of heaven. Even so cool. far away, even now, their eyes are on you. But here in the night under the world, you are safe. You return to your senses, gasping. Your hands are cold and numb. How long were you watching the stars? <gasps> oh, cool. Um, okay. So we've done that one. Wait, open gathering... the high gate is an option now. Oh, is it? No, it's not. Still locked. Oh, it's locked. Okay. We don't have the materials for it. Uh, we can just look at the stars again. I wanna. I wanna. Uh, this, what's the story one? We now have Hunter's Eye. Oh God. Um. So you heard a story. Yes. This is what the rumors meant. A hunter frozen in the ice, hands contorted to claw, uh, claws, mouth agape. With her left hand, she has plucked her own eye from the socket. It lies very close to the surface of the ice. If the stories are true, there's a dark virtue in that eye. Take it then. But perhaps you should put it in a jar. So we've got a, a hunter's eye in a jar now. Cool. Um, that's a thing we've got. All right. Um, and it says, eat the flesh of the deep lurkers and your eyes will change. So I reckon if we were to kill like a, a kraken or a squid or something like that, or a, a crab. No, probably crabs are surface. Um, we, things would happen. Consume. Consume. Oh. Uh, <laughs> eat everything. <laughs> okay, right. so that's just a little report that we could give back. Um, and then if we go across the... the oh, oh! Oh, we've discovered <gasps> we discovered fuel supplies, everybody. Boo! We're not oh. going to go hungry. Boo. God damn it! We're capable explorers. <laughs> <laughs> so, so are you saying this is actually as yet a successful, a relatively? This successful is actually going. Run? It's that typical thing where, like, when I play this on my own, it's a disaster. But the one time I play it on stream, and I want to show you how what happens when you eat each other and when you run out of fuel. Um, <laughs> It's not happening. <laughs> I'm finding I mean, everything. <laughs> now that we've tasted of the Ruby Church or whatever it was called, um, can we can we not just can we not just decide to skip like a regular meal and just eat the plausible surgeon? Uh, well, we can't do it until we go hungry. So until this, well, it could uh, be it could be quite soon. Oh, we're we're going very we're going it's it's it, we're going mad. We're going because I've I've taken the lights off because I want. You're to You're not go the inside. right level oh. yet. I've I've gone. Oh, insane. turning the lights off. Yeah. Makes you worse. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So you can see the, what the terror. What is that? The terror is going up. What is oh it? Oh my god. Oh, look at this. Is that a giant lighthouse? It looks like it, yeah. Oh, I love it's this It's a Dwemer game. Fortress. Beautiful. I love this game. Horror. It's very cool. Bats eating people. It's great. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I had no idea. Oh, this place is huge. Go. Yeah. Frost oh, found. Wow. Um, this is rad. Let's see. Go. Where's the entrance find... to this? Yeah, oh, I hang on. Find... Must be this oh, way. Yeah. What the No. Hell? Yeah, it is. Perfect. Here we go. Man, if there's any gods here, oh my god, we're going to go down. <laughs> we're going to eat them. We're going to eat yeah. them. Yeah. <laughs> Apparently, it's not the white bats god. <laughs> I thought that was going to be at the last place. Wow. Uh, Holy crap. Towers and ramps and galleries and stairs of ice raised and spun like an architect's honey uh, dream. The towers are utterly pristine, untouched by human life, but a pitiable encampment squats by the dock. Um, oh, so we could we could hire a mechanic. Oh. Uh, we could take tea with the squatters on the dock. We could ask them about the council. Uh, we could, if we had... Ah... Uh, um, uh, if we were sane, we could go in, um, but unfortunately, uh, we are not sane, so we cannot how many, go in. How many supplies have we got? Uh, two. So if we hire the uh, mechanic, we'll have four supplies. You know what I'm saying? Ah. <laughs> ah. We'll hire them. Okay, so the mechanic has come on board. Um, Welcome we can aboard. take tea with some of the squad. We can ask them about the castle. Yes. If you can enter, you should not. And we've uh, got a tale of terror. Um, so this is sacred right. ground. You might be en able to enter the castle before the appointed time, but you'd be just spoiling uh, sacred ground, my friend. So spooky sacred castle. Uh, we'll just get this report. So one tip I have, if you're playing this for the first time and playing it sensibly, as soon as you get a report on something, 
get, gather a few and then go back to London because then you can sell, the, like, hand those reports in and get loads of, like, money and resources and stuff like that. Um, sure. That makes sense. But, yeah. you know, if you want to YOLO it like we are. <clears throat> um, okay, so we're too, we're too insane to go in there just yet. Yeah, so unfortunately we can't go in. But, um, we but it do said something about the appointed have... time. So um, is there another... So the point of time, time would be if we were saner, I think. Right, okay. Oh, cool. <gasps> there he is. There he is. There he is. Oh, what a, what a dashing, delicious looking boy. I know. Yeah. He looks Scrumbly meaty. He looks mm. well meaty. Right, yum, I'm going to carry on trying to blast us into... I'm, I'm going to try and ruin this for us. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to mess up our day. Although I have just Do it. another thing. Oh, I mean, God, we look, have not done a lot of exploring. Look at how big this is as wow. well. Look, that's ridiculous. So yeah. cool. Oh, oh, oh. Uh -oh. Hello. Uh -oh. oh, what's his bass? Uh, uh, pirate Wait, ship. Wait, no, I think no, I think there's a swarm of bats attacking that ship. That's no, it's fine. a pirate ship. Ignore they, me. It's a pirate ship. No, it's a pirate ship. We, we don't okay. know. Oh. I want us to go hungry and, and die that way. So, I mean, live that way. Um. Uh, sure. <laughs> I just Got want. It. I Got just it. want to eat my crewmates. That's What's this light? Is that a lighthouse? I think it's a lighthouse. Yeah, it looks like. What a are those cool. little dots in the ocean that are just giving off light? Um, are they boys. just little little boys? Buoys. Buoys. Oh. Buoy. How do you buoy. say it? Buoy or boy? Yeah, buoy. David uh, buoy. Boy. I just say boy. Boy, boy, yeah. oh, boy. Oh, jelly flip. Oh, it's got a lot of health. <gasps> yeah, I'm going away. Bye. Oh, no, 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 no. Just keep keep kiting it. Oh wait, can you only fire from the front? Yeah. Well, right. you can upgrade. You can upgrade. Oh, oh shit! Run! Oh. Run! <laughs> oh, oh you can fast. you can upgrade and um like yeah get fast uh, like dual guns and faster engines and more storage um and all this kind of stuff. But um, that will take double time. time that engine. Double time the engine. It Full is sail. on double time. Full Full sail. Sail. I'm giving it a lot. She's got captain. <laughs> sail. <laughs> oh. Sail. <laughs> sail. <laughs> Uh, if I turn my lights off, it won't see me. I just want us to go like hungry, guys. We, come on, we're, we're, we're almost there. We're almost there. Okay. <laughs> Starve me. Starve me. Come on. Oh, it looks like go I on, think sure. they've given up now. Yeah. Nice. Perfect. I am going to ignore Perfect. this. I know there's a port there, but I'm going to ignore that for now. Why are we not going hungry? Sure. Um, you can also get mutinies as well. Like if you really push your uh, push your crew, you can get mutinies. So the the red bar on the hunger is that our like current hunger level, and mm -hmm. then when it hits the bar in the middle, we eat. Mm -hmm. Also, what's the red dots around the? That's terror uh, building. So that's how it's it building up. pretty quick. Yep, okay. because I turned the lights off. Right. Oh, have you? Yep. There's no lights on. Okay. <laughs> oh, I see. I thought it was the uh, blue lights. Yeah. Okay. Or the green lights. Get hungry. Green Get hungry. lights. Get hungry. Uh, who are we oh. eating first? Yeah. Um, surgeon? Actually, no, because we should probably eat the engineer, because then the surgeon can, like, will be skilled at cutting them up. Oh, uh, he will make oh, a god. better... Oh, God. Oh, you see this? Oh, hi. That's a big shark. Hello. It's a bad... Y yeah. We, we cannot bad. fight this right now. That's so bad. Lad. If you look up the official art for Sunless Sea, you'll find this little sharky boy. Um, really? So I'm gonna I'm gonna stay away. I'm gonna stay away. So I want us to I'm, I'm guessing just getting destroyed by a monster. The dialogue is like, your ship is uh, broken. You're dead. Pretty much. Whereas yeah. if you have like hunger, then there's ways to get out. There's of it, way. Right? Yeah, hunger and fuel. There's things that you can do. Um, okay. Uh, yes. Dark, mysterious Cute. things. What happens if you just ram an island? Then you blow up. Oh, it does actually do something. Yeah, it'll, it'll screw oh. up your. It'll um. It'll hurt your hull. Your hull. Your hull. Your big hull boy. Right. Oh, oh. Terra looking, by the way. Sorry. Oh, How's Terra looking? Hmm. The Terra is not looking good. No, it's not looking good. There's a big crab over there as well. <laughs> that I'm trying to avoid. Um, okay. While I'm while I'm uh, trying to drop guide us to our death, do we have any donations that have come in? We do, Captain. Uh, we've got a half hundo from OV Raptor. Thank you very much, OV Woo! Raptor. Uh, a full hundo from Simon RGH. Thank you. Wow. Thank you. Uh, 25 from Miostis and Sipsaru. Thank you very much. And a 25 from Colt45J. Thank you. And another 25 from Rodjar13. Thank you. 25 from Mr. Bones. Are there any messages attached to these, or are you just skipping over them all? 
Do you want me to read the messages? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Only if they say nice things. If they say mean things, they can go away. They all say very lovely things. So I'll start with Raptor. He says, Hey folks, love both Yogs and High Rollers. You never cease to provide the top quality entertainment despite the tumultuous year. So thanks all for all the love. All of to all of you, thank you. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that was my fault. <laughs> thank you very much. And you. Simon, your Hundo donation, thank you very much. Had to save my big dono for the Chaos Stream. Thank you to all the Yogs keeping me sane and entertained throughout 2020. You've all been the background to so many of us working from home. Love you all. Thank you, Simon. Wonderful. Thank you. Oh, here we go. Uh, here we go is guys. it happening? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Your crew groans with hunger. Your crew need provisions. Uh, we've got eight crew as well. As well as these guys, we've got eight crew. Um, you can all tighten your belts, but bad things will begin to happen. The card will remain available as long as hunger is over 50. Don't let hunger Feast. reach 100. We can feast. feast. We could make soup. We could, feast. you know. Feast. Here we feast. go, boys. Feast. <laughs> do, we, do we not choose who? Oh. oh. So if you notice, oh. we now have seven crew. We ate three dudes? Uh, we ate uh, one. We were on eight. Oh, we were okay. on eight, and we ate eight. I'm and a now hungry we're boy. Yeah, we're hungry, hungry Ooh. boys. You and your cannibal acolytes have selected your next victim. Behind closed doors, you wait, watch, and strike. You are merciful. Your knives are sharp. Oh. The rest of your crew will benefit from a nourishing anonymous stew. We don't Perhaps even tell them? They know nothing. Perhaps they don't oh. want to know. We've gained a lot. It. We're getting very haunted, guys. Really haunted. Also, we're now two cannibals. We're now, we're now two menaces. Two cannibals. Love it. Wonderful. <laughs> Wonderful. So, what Wonderful. happens when the terror gets to the top? By the way, do we just do we just do go? You know what? I turn have over? not. I have not actually experienced a hundred terror. So, here we go. Ninety six. Here we go, boys. Here we go. Here, here, we, we, go, go. here we go. Get ready. Get ready. Cthulhu get himself is coming to get you. Cthulhu himself is coming to spook Going. you. We're also running out of fuel as well. We're down to one fuel. And our, Can you our stop? hunger is going Could, up. Are you able to just stop moving, by the way? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, stop. cool. You can also go backwards. Look, no, we don't backwards. want to do that. Just, I'm going backwards. You know. Look, I'm going backwards. Yeah, to Marine Circle. You're trekking for something. Across the universe. <laughs> Always going <laughs> forward because you can't find reverse. Here we go, Woo! the big hundo. Obviously, Boom. Okay, oh, go. oh god, I've lost my goddamn mind. Oh, oh god, <gasps> mutiny! Fear and despair have destroyed the loyalty of your crew. Half of those who remain have taken up arms against you. You've taken shelter in the bridge while their shots ring out. We can cut them down. Um, damn them all. Or we, can attend, or... or we can attend to uh, attempt to win them over. Um, Eight percent. Fifteen percent. Cut them down. Cut them down. Cut them down. Cut the, cut the ones we take down. down. That's a good meal. Yeah. More food for um, us. Um. Right. It's probably not going to work out, boys. This is probably it. Fifteen percent, I believe. Ladies and gentlemen, yeah. it's been a pleasure. I believe, Captain. Oh no, we fell. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you take cover with your loyalists and hold them at bay as long as you can. One by one, you run out of ammunition. When they storm the bridge, you fight them hand to hand, to no avail. One of them smashes you through the glass of the bridge windows. You tumble to the deck as they shout in desperate victory and land with a final crunch. And there we go. We are dead. There we go. Uh, we will be ba, more. It was a good run. It was a good run. It was a good run. Ba, a good run. Ba, ba. So, um, things that we take over. Um, your first captain has died. Do not worry. These things happen. Um, so, we can basically choose what to take over and who our next... Um, captain will be are they a rival a pupil a salvager a, sh a shipmate or a correspondent and then that depend that dictates what gets carried over um if we had ah. things uh like uh so if we pick let's say rival so i think one of our mutineers took over right so we can basically carry over things uh we can carry over mm. a shipmate if we want so if we went shipmate whoops um we could carry over an officer so we could take the the ferret or the mechanic over. Um, but so not yeah. the other guy. Uh, not the other guy. Don't want him. Huh? Don't he want killed him. us. He well, did I think it. because I think because there's a basic officer that you can always take from your the start. So any right. officers that you pick up along the way, you can <coughs> transfer them over. Um, so yeah, oh, that's a that's way cool. to kind of do that. 
Um, yeah. And then you start again from the beginning. <gasps> there we go. Very there you cool. Go. Love it. So, so that cool. Is a speedy look at Sunless Sea, um, and that is why it's one of my favourite games in the bundles because you could honestly just spend ages. Like this. And it's me. It's the stories. I love the stories. Um, yeah. You know what? I think this game on its own is worth twenty five pounds. Honestly, but no. Yeah. You get like <laughs> yeah. forty others as well for just twenty five pound if you donate to jinglejam.tiltify.com. This is just one of the many games you can get. And boy howdy, if you're thinking boy, howdy. Well, this this must be this must be the only good game in the bundle. You're goddamn wrong, okay? <laughs> you're goddamn wrong. There's so there's many, loads of good so games. many amazing games. There's so many amazing games. Um so if you haven't got it, go get it. And if you have got the bundle already, download it, give it a try, drop a review, say hey, Tom sent you. <laughs> <laughs> and they'll be like, Who's, who's Tom? Who the fuck is Tom? Who who the hell is Tom? <laughs> Who, who is Thomas? Yeah. <laughs> Thomas um, Hazel. You simply must meet Thomas. Thomas. What's uh what's next on the list, Kim Kimbus? Uh your favourite, Thomas Hazel, Dungeon of Nehilbuch. Nehilbuch. Um you quite enjoyed this, didn't you, Thomas Hazel? I did enjoy this, yeah. So this is a game we're playing because uh the publishers of Dungeons of <laughs> is um has some games in the bundle. Yeah, and, so um, uh, they also have Dead in Bermuda and Away Journey to the Unexpected um in the bundle. Yeah, uh, and uh, yeah, I gave it a try, and you know what? It's really good. It's really good. I think um, as well. I think us being um, Dungeons and Dragons um, nerds, we quite like it. We, we, we do Not only that, I'm an XCOM nerd, and it's yes. it's dungeon delving fantasy XCOM with loads of different classes who have loads of different abilities. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, you know, tile based, turn based uh, combat with you know percentage chances to hit and all of that stuff. It's really really cool, and you can do a lot of uh, like um, Chimera Squad, XCOM Chimera Squad. There was a lot of moves you can do that was kind of team based. So if you do this thing with this dude, then this guy will be able to do this particular move you can do a lot of that in this um and it's very very cool i think the uh donation reader by the way is underneath it's our underneath cameras me, yeah um oh, and yeah. it doesn't it doesn't take itself seriously at all as well by the way like nice. these characters yeah. are very very um Funny. They're funny. They're funny, um, funny boys. Um, it kind of reminds me of. Do you, did you ever play a game called Death Spank? Um, <laughs> I remember it. Yeah. Do you remember Death Spank? It kind of reminds me. Yeah, of that. I do actually. Yeah. Like yeah, it reminds me of that. Um, cool. Yeah. Um, there's a lot of a lot of different characters that you get. Uh, are we gonna jump in with the tutorial, or are we gonna jump in no. with the? I've done the tutorial. Okay. I mean, we could start with the tutorial. But I think <gasps> look at these dudes. We could just we could just do it like this. Um, yeah. So this is our party. Um, we've got your very classic D and D tropes. We've got the ranger, the barbarian, the elf, the wi uh, the thief, the wizardess, and the ogre. And there's a dwarf somewhere. Where is he? He's somewhere in there. He's he's somewhere in this. Where is he? Is he? Where is he? Oh no, story. He's disappeared. Um, oh, all right, okay. Oh. Yeah, it's all right. It's, it's, so I've done the tutorial bit because um, I thought let's just you know jump ahead because tutorial's great but not very fun to show. Uh, you know, uh, we want to get into the thick of it. So um, anyone who's a fan of RPGs, you know what this is all about. Look, so we've got all our party got members some here. Nuts for the squirrels. God, I'm trying to find a space on the screen where the cameras can go. Uh, to yeah, there is sure. there is a lot, um, a lot going on. Um, but yeah, we've got skill trees. Um, you know, that everyone loves a skill tree and, and hot stats. Yeah. Look, if I just, if I just, yeah. there we go. Turn this off for a second. There you go. Whole bunch of stats. Um, yeah. Very cool. Very, it's very in-depth stats. As well. It does actually remind me of D&D in like kind of how in-depth stats Very similar can be. stats, yeah. Um, yeah. But yeah, so there's that. Um, and yeah, you can do things like, you know, a quick, <laughs> hold on a minute, off we go again. Bye. Um, <clears throat> so obviously I've, I've just started the run through, so I haven't got a lot of equipment, but Crap, what um, a mess. Yeah. you can also equip loads of stuff. You can put things on your belt. Um, one minor also, thing. Also, 
The yeah. equipment does change the cosmetic look of your character. That's as well. what I was going to say. That's always there an important go. thing for me. I was like going to say that. Equipping the braces yeah. uh, actually puts braces on them. Yeah. So look, uh, no braces, and now, now has braces. <gasps> Very cool. Yeah. Favorite. I know thing. it's just a dumb little thing, but no, it's, it, it's I, important I, to my immersion. It's important. It's important. Like, yeah. It's very important. So you can make your characters how um, you want to make them. Skill tree. The models are really nice. They're like yeah. really they are. clean. Yeah. Really the clean. animations um, are really nice as well. It's just yeah. really nicely done. Genuinely um, big fan of this. I was playing it last night. I could have been playing Cyberpunk last night, and I was playing this last night. Hello, noble adventurers. Would you <laughs> be interested go. in some magication? Oh, he does Hi, look like Are Lewis. you a wizard? Oh, Which goodness one looks like Lewis? me. I, I'd never. Ranger. I'm a farm magician. <laughs> Toby Esperin, at your service. Ranger. Farm magician? What is that exactly? I create magical medications called magications. Oh, I'm oh, specialized oh, in magic oh. pharmacopoeia called Farm Magic. Oh, oh. Fine, but what's it for? Does it actually work or is it bullshit? Ooh, for example, he said it was bullshit. Is it for bullshit? bullshit? Or to get rid of hangovers. Adventurers tend to like those. Lovely. This is a rather unlikely place for a shop, isn't it? Well, it's right. cheap. I got this spot for right. peanuts. I'm currently just settling in. Come back later. I'll show you some interesting magications sure. at very affordable rates. Huh. I thought that no one had ever entered this dungeon before. Oh, quite the contrary. It's very popular. Who told you such mm. things? Our sponsor, some hooded guy we met at Twisted Veil. Vale. Yeah, typical hiring procedure for a party of beginners. Uh, say, by any chance have you seen a dwarf? He's sort of dwarf-like. Why are we looking for him? We're doing fine without him. No, I can see him. <laughs> but if he's small, he could be sneaking by right under our noses. We're also looking for the third statuette of Gradual Fulcrum. Sneak around no. the eyes. The statue at the Gradual Fulcrum. I thought it was the baguette of Rapadulfra. Rapadulfra. Oh, it. it's... oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> ah, the 12th statuette of Gladilfra. Never heard Gladilfra. of it, sorry. But you should ask around at the inn. Maybe someone will know about it. <laughs> yeah, right. It's fun. An inn. In a dungeon. They're really taking oh. fantasy names An to the inn. next level. Do they have ale? Oh, I mean, yeah. Some areas are Does open to the public. Whole, Take the whole stairs. book. You'll Does that actually yourself. stand for anything, or is that just them taking the piss out of fantasy names? Our victorious names? party travels forth in its quest I, for the no, statuette and their there is a French, challenged um, companion who disappeared online after audio sit. Wait, hang on. Oh, no, th that's okay. So in two thousand and one, there was a, uh, a. It's called a MP3 saga, so it's kind of like, I guess, a radio play, following a party okay. of adventurers in a parody of a heroic fantasy role-playing game. Okay. And it was, oh. the story was adapted into a comic series, a set of novels, and a video game. It's a oh, French-language very... online audio series. Oh. You could call it a podcast before podcast. Les Donjons de Nihilville. Oh, that's rad. I hope this okay. is a worthy investment. How much money do I have? Two thirds. <clears throat> Uh, I'm just gonna get some stuff. Do I give him the gold now? Nice. Uh, Easy vision. dungeon. Easy. Easy, boys. Easy. Easy. Yeah, Tom, Tom was like, I'm gonna play this, like, you know, after Cyberpunk. And I was like, you're never gonna <laughs> stop playing Cyberpunk. Like. No, I mean, like. <laughs> It was it was it was one of those things where it was um, like in the lead up to Cyberpunk. Do I start a game? I know I'm going to stop playing it. Uh, and after Cyberpunk, if it's as good as everyone says it is, am I going to play any game ever again? Probably not. But you know what? I actually really like this game. And yeah. I, I'm, there's been a couple of times where I'm like, after you know my six, ten, twelve hour stints in Cyberpunk, I'm like, I'm going to I'm going to stop and play Dungeon of Nihil. <laughs> Nickelback. We have been calling Dungeon it the Dungeon of Nickelback. Of Nickelback. Um, sorry, yeah. developers yeah, and no publishers. Bad. It's actually very, very cool. Um, yeah. Look at this dungeon. The more charisma a character chest? has, the more support they'll get from their allies when they attack. Yeah, so that's like one of the ways that they can get um, bonuses and like the sort of tactics of the game and the positional um, placement of the characters in combat works really well like the ranger has i think the ranger has quite high charisma yeah so he can if he stands next to someone when they're attacking they get a bonus from him like he bardic inspirations them yep um and it's it's really cool it's got a lot of things a lot of turn-based strategy like combat turn-based games do but puts it into a fantasy way that actually works because there's a lot of games that have done that or tried that um mm. and didn't quite do it also, by the way, 
We are 265 pounds away. Is that maths? 265? It is. Yeah. God, I'm clever. Um, <laughs> 265 away oh, from the 1.685 We're real uh, close. mil goal. Um, That's not bad. I'll make one really happy. Yeah. It'll make it worth him giving up his cyberpunk time. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so how come the ogre can't smash through that? I don't know. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what I'm meant to be doing right now. Um, Maybe increase his strength in, in see, some way. This is the danger of, like, you know, finishing the tutorial, which is nice and safe. Oh, shit, <laughs> oh. there's a password. Password. Uh, how about a clue? Uh, it's on the tip pineapple. of my tongue. Swordfish. Music. Three syllables makes Three music. Syllables makes music. <laughs> Saxophone. Wrong. Saxophone. 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 <laughs> Oh, shit, there's a password. Uh, uh, mandolin! Right. Stop saying mandolin, elf! <laughs> Saxomoph saxophone. Okay. Piano. Xylophone. Uh, Violin. Trombone. I'm guessing I can't go in here. Uh, da, Big da, da, guitar. Big guitar. Recorder. <laughs> the djembe. Um, yeah, yeah, Any more? Uh, loot, loot, loot. Oh, I've actually, I think I've gone the wrong way to find the dwarf. Silly dwarf. Oh. Um, we, could just, we could just forget about the dwarf. We could just forget about it. But yeah, I like, I, I think the one thing that surprised me was kind of similar to what you're saying, is like how much the stats actually matter. Um, and like you do have to kind of pay attention to it. So yeah, you do have to think tactically about like, who do I pair up with who? Who do I move to this mm. position? Who do I, like what abilities do I use? And what kind of weaknesses and strengths do my enemies have? Um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's, Very cool. let's find a dwarf for Christmas. Um, I mean, it says that it's up on the, oh, have I just gone on the wrong? Oh, it's the stairs. Damn. I should have gone on the stairs. I went on the damn. left. I went on the left. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, look at that loincloth. <gasps> Hello. T -O, T O S T O S Oh my god. Oh well that's it. Jingle jam's cancelled. We got everyone uh, banned. We've done it. It was us. <laughs> Sorry. Hold on a minute. Just, there we go. If we, it's better. It's better if we disconnect uh, now. Lovely. If we disconnect now, then it was just Kim's fault, Ree. No. <laughs> Don't do uh, that to me. Part in the dungeon of the no. Our adventures end up Ooh, in a rather strange games. bar with a thirst for fresh glory and honorable ale. Oh, or is it the other way around? Yep, it's an actual tavern. Open to the public. <laughs> I remember what taverns this were like. This dungeon is so weird. <laughs> we should ask around. Maybe someone's seen oh, Donald. Do you know why we would want to look for him? The elf There's really hates party. the dwarf in no this, by the way. Really behind. hates the dwarf. Ah, oh, yes. Amazing. Short people racist. Uh, hello? Oh, oh Paladin! <gasps> Hi! Nope. Now, which one do I listen to? The scruffy oh. half pint or the dimwit and flip flops here? Indeed, we have a dwarf companion. He's gone missing. I've been hired to find uh -huh. a dwarf. Maybe it's the same guy. I'd be surprised we just got here. I mean, all dwarfs are the same. Who hired you? The dungeon master? The dungeon master hired you. The co op running this dungeon. There's an Ooh. evil dwarf stealing stuff, mostly gold and Never ale. trust an elf. A co op. Oh. This just keeps getting weirder. And what's this about an evil dwarf? Ours isn't evil. Let's forget this weirdo and a rant about dwarves. Spin your head, salad brains. I like a breeze. Now shut up, everybody. Can you all help me take him down? Is that what Sentry's like? Shut up, everybody. But we're really <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, just admit you're a chicken. Forgot your butt bravery and your other pair of pants. I remembered everything. We even have a lighter. In any case, this could be interesting. Might be right. Work. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna go oh, find sure. we're gonna this find the door. Gonna, okay, another yeah, 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 What's this? <laughs> I've got a stream to do, guys. Uh, sure. Right. Merchants, taverns, resting heals your health points and uh, your character's injuries. So it's kind of like uh, a long rest, short rest a tavern. situation here. <laughs> oh, uh, very cool. Tavern. Uh, waitress. Right, Hello. I'll have a quick What's look and see Isn't what kind of, uh, <laughs> if there's like stuff I can buy. Oh, there's the barman. The barman's got things. Trade. Right, have you got any cool equipment? Because I really need... He's got eggs. He's got eggs. Well, buy, got... buy all the eggs. He's got a sausage as well. Um, <laughs> a throwing hen. Okay, Ooh. But if you buy eggs, you can get infinite Money throwing hens. Just um, well, you probably need. You bombs. know, you don't <laughs> actually hatch eggs by just throwing them. 
No, Wait, this that's... isn't Minecraft. No, it is though. <laughs> it's how it works sure. in real life, right? <laughs> Your kitchen must be a mess. It's actually real shiny. It's like an egg. It's all yolk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nothing but yolk. <laughs> no, no yolk. I guess yeah, because if it sets, it goes shiny and hard, right? Yeah, yeah. So everything's got this protective, <laughs> hard case. Slippery egg. sheen. <laughs> A real slippery <laughs> sheen to it. Oh my gosh. Right, while I try and find someone selling me equipment. Oh, here we go. Uh, does anyone got any donations they want to read out? Well, uh, I don't have access to it. Read, get back to it. Got this it. time, read the messages. Except I've got to start from the beginning. Okay, fine. So I will start from the beginning. Mini noises, thank you. Hi, Kim, Tom, and Reed. This is my third year of donating, though it's a little less this year. You all do really good work, so this is my way of giving back. Looking forward to your birthday stream, Kim! Yay! A festive biscuit says a heart. Thank you! Uh, Lawfev, thank you all so much. You got me through a lot. Thank you very much for your donation. Thank you very much. Uh, Stephen, love you all so much. The Oxcast have been keeping me smiling for the last 10 years. Thank you so much, Stephen! And the half hundo from Sam Skywalker. Just want to say I'm a big High Rollers fan and to keep up the good work. Hey. Thank you very much. Hi, Rollers. And... Best Rollers. Woo woo! And Night Jim, thank you for your donation for Kim's help. For Kim's help. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was for a rant I had at the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> Hire a person to help me put socks on. <laughs> <laughs> George D, thank you. First time donating to Jingle Jam. First time. Thank you very much. Wish you all the best and keep it up. Thank you very much, thank George you. D. Uh, Luke Colo Ooh. with a heart. Thank you very much. Oh, what's his Hello. dance? Okay. Oh, one other thing that we Brom can hates do. Riddles, except the riddle of steel. <laughs> Typical barbarian. Uh, one thing we can do is the thief. Uh, where is the thief? Thief, thief, thief. There we go. Uh, he has uh, detect traps on. So this is detect traps. So that's oh, his perfect. aura. So he can actually detect traps and then disarm them should he yeah. choose to. Um, Get disarming. But yeah, I'm gonna swap over, swap over to the wizard. Um, but yeah, I thought that was a really cute thing. Th there is a yeah. lot of D and D in this. Like you, you will mm. recognise when I get into a fight eventually. There is a fair amount of D and D in this. I'm, I think, unfortunately, I've done that thing where I was like, yeah, I've done the tutorial, and now we're gonna have a cool, like, free flowing fight. Um, I've hit the story bit where it's like, okay, you've done the tutorial. Now have a nice little break, and then we'll go back to the fights. <laughs> Oh, loot. loot, though. Uh, loot, 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 oh, loot, loot, uh, loot. Hold. What's that? Oh. oh. Yeah. I'll, okay. I'll Maybe we get all three of those. Uh, yeah. If you hold tab, by the way, it um, highlights all the loot. Oh. Cheeky. Oh. We might oh. need some uh, magic in there. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Explosive okay. bombs. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Mm -hmm. uh, I've currently got those equipped to the thief, so the thief can chuck them around. Um, no. Yeah. Very cool. Right, keep going, Re. More donations. More cool. money. More money to charity. Have we hit our goal yet? We're like 0.4% away. We're so away. close. Come We're on, so close. everybody. We are 65 oh, pounds away. away. So if close. Everybody, if everybody in in uh, the chat right now donates like 10p, we'll get there. Yeah. Right, well, let, let me keep going, guys. That real quick. No, no, that's not. Uh, right. Flower, so thank you for your donation. I love you guys. Right, Kim, wear that top how you want. Rebel. Rio hair is awesome. Tom, <laughs> hi. Thank you, Flower. Uh, so love the jingle jam. Keep it up. Love all the ogs. You guys uh, really help people so every Hello. day. Well, you thank you. It's your that donations you that help people. So thank you very much for keeping them coming in. Ace Fawns, thank you very much. Donating for a better world next year and all the years after. Better than this one. Sorry, correction. If everybody in the chat right now donates. Two pence. Two P. We will hit our goal. No, but two we P want, each. We want more than that, though. Like it's the two P drive. We... Let's go. <laughs> two P drive, everybody. Two P or not two P. Two P P. Two P P drive. Two P P P two drive. Jump onto jinglejam.tiltfy.com and give us that two P drive. Uh, <laughs> what do you mean you can't? Can you not? Well, in that case, round it up to a pound. <laughs> but we'll call it the two P drive. How many people do we have in 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 the stream? How how many people are here watching us? Sixty five thousand. Um, what? Two P drive, everybody. <laughs> two P drive. I have achieved two P. No, don't do it in bits. Do it to the tiltify. 
and, and, and if you want a specific charity to donate towards and you have no ideas, my choice is 125 and Tom's is, what was it? Um, special effect and Reese's special access effect. spurt. And the beauty so. is, is that if you donate 2p, it actually translates to an actual 2p coin. And we will give them a jar Drop of individual two pence coins, and they'll love it for it. We did it! We did it! Two pence! I don't actually have the money, so we're just gonna have to. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. Woo! Such you. joy in my heart. I've also just noticed that Milo is so happy. Oh, just, oh hey. look at this cat. Cool look at Mark. It. He's just like. <laughs> look oh, at my cat who's radiator. just sprawled himself out by the radiator. Look at this nonsense. Oh, damn. Look at him go. He's so excited. He's so excited oh. that we hit the oh, target. Just in time. Hello. Aww, hello. Aww, hello. Kelly time. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Welcome to my dark coven. <laughs> Ree, <laughs> Ree, call dark Craig and tell Craig. Tell tell Craig. Craig. I'll, I'll, I'll ring Craig. Here we go. Isn't I'm he just next Craig to you? Cross. Isn't he right next he's to you? He's gone somewhere. I don't know where he's gone. Oh, he's okay. he's disappeared somewhere. <laughs> okay. So he's not in the same room. Whoops. All right, we're going to call Craig. I'm going to have to go into my contacts list. Where is he? I never bring food for anything. So this is is he not on your deal. important contacts list? Mm, he's somewhere. <laughs> How is it taking me so long to find Craig's number? What's wrong with me? <laughs> Shouldn't there you have go. it in your brain, like, you know, engraved? <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Craigle is on the phone. <laughs> Here we go. Ooh, I've got a, I've got a thing. I've got an uh, amulet of astral... Thingamajiggy. Where did that go? <laughs> is this Craig Frost of the Yogs cast? Hat Films editor Craig Frost. Yes. <gasps> <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I thought it would be very important for you to know that we have raised 1,685,075 oh, pounds and 13 pence for the Jingle Jam. In one stream, that's amazing. In one stream. In one stream. <laughs> the power of the 2P drive. Yeah, the 2P drive is powerful, Craig. Well done. Congratulations on raising over <laughs> in one stream. <laughs> you sound really excited about it. You sound so, so pleased. It's like we're going in circles. Please. <laughs> <laughs> He's overcome, guys. He's absolutely overcome. Hang up Speechless. on him. Emotion. Hang up on him. Hang up on this guy. I'll let you get back to work, Craig. Th thank you for your kind words. Thank you for your um, encouragement. Um, okay. Thank, thank you very much. For <laughs> <laughs> it's very kind of you. Good. Now we wait. <laughs> Ready up your All weapons. Right. I just hung off on him. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. It did sound like text to speech. <laughs> there we go. That's your fiance. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> That's your fiance of 12. How long? 12 yeah. years. 12 years, just over, yeah. Oh. Right on, buddy. <laughs> looks exactly like his evil hey, Oh dear. Bless him. He was so excited. <laughs> so, so <laughs> clearly. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. I'm really so excited. Oh my god. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Um, oh, well, that, thanks everybody. <laughs> Your guts out with an oyster fork. Yes, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. What do you yeah. want, Night Jar? I just saw like 20 messages in a row. Tom, Thomas, Tom, Tom, listen to me. What? <laughs> She's very needy, Night Jar, isn't she? She always wants our attention. Night Jar, the cat. Wait, is this combat? Yeah. I'm not listening to you anymore. Oh. We're in combat. Um, So this is the purport. Pre 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 Prep phase. <laughs> yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. I can't, Ooh. guys. 
I can't. Um, Tom, do you want to explain what the prep phase is? Did you get this far <coughs> Did you, when, you, when you played it? You, I, I mean, I, yeah, I went beyond the play game button, <laughs> Kim. Um, yeah. <laughs> explain, to so, the, explain to the children what's going on. So in the prep phase, you've got your party of boys. You, uh, this is where you can, before the combat begins, equip <laughs> them with whatever's needed. So it's a chance to look at the enemies that you're up against and say, oh, this thing won't work, so I'll just really quickly equip them with this, change their stuff. But also on the map itself, you can change where they start too. So you don't want the uh, elf at the front who specializes in like bow and arrow God, stuff. What a mess. You want all your big beefy boys at the front, like the barbarian, or you want your thief to be way out the side. So you can change the positioning before the, the combat begins. And in, in certain rooms as well, you can also put them in totally different areas um, as well. Uh, so it's pretty cool. I, I think in just in jump in, right just dive in. Yeah. Um, hold yeah. On, I just want to like. <clears throat> oh, wait, where's the chicken? The throwing hen. There we go. <gasps> Where is it? Okay, equip. Right. Equip yeah. That. Give the barbarian some range, but just I in case you can't reach the guys. Wait, how can I? I want no. Hold on. Unequip the you, ham, and then equip my throwing chicken. <gasps> Oh. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Nice. Okay. Um, so, so we've got turn order up top, just the under moment. there. So range is going first. Then we've got Kohan, Kohan, Conan, uh, and then Paladin, and then Evil Dwarf. Um, so you can also look at like all of their kind of stats and what sort of enemy they are. Um, and have a think about positioning. D&D um, &D rules apply. So things like uh, these pillars and stuff can give you cover. Uh, these pews are pretty good for cover as well. Uh, right. Let's start with the ranger. Um, <gasps> ranger. Ranger. I don't think I can move outside of um, outside of my little box of starting, Tom, on the beginning bit. I this is still the prep phase. Yeah, I know. Oh, crap. I moved him by accident. Didn't mean to. Um, Just turn him around oh. again. Can I move him around? Oh, yeah. Okay. There we go. Yeah. Uh, right. I want to move her further back uh, and face that way. Um, what do you think is an optimum setup, Thomas? I'll move you. So, what are we actually up against here? Um, we've got a bunch of dwarves, uh, level two dwarves. Ah. We've got a crow, <clears throat> a crow, a crossbowman, a crossbow dwarf. We've got an evil dwarf um, who looks like a standard heavy. Uh, got another evil dwarf, uh, crossbowman, uh, another evil dwarf, an another evil. Oh my dwarf, god, there's a lot. Another, Holy crap. E another evil dwarf crossbowman and another evil dwarf. Oh, we're uh, dead. One of the. Oh, come on. Um, we've okay, also got go. A paladin. Go to the north. What is that dwarf hiding behind that wooden crate? Is that a destructible crate? Uh, yeah, so I can destroy that. Is it a metal as, crate? Um, thingy, but... <laughs> oh, re. Oh, re. Um, um, <laughs> the thing is, I so could yeah. destroy this crate as the orc, uh, ogre, um, but I feel like it would be a waste of time. Like, I could send the ogre out, and then we could just have these, uh, the, ranger, the ranged women uh, shoot over. That? No, I, I think I think smash the. You want to have the ogre smash the box, so that the ranged guys have a better shot at him, and mm -hmm. then that's when you use this corner of the map as like your your bastion. Bunker. You want all of every, you want all of the ranged people to get into that massive L shaped uh, cover because that's powerful. Okay. That. That's okay. the place you want to capture. Are you um, happy with this setup to start with? Shh. Sure. Okay, yeah. so my range is going to go first. So, what do you think we should? Should we? Where should we focus first? Should we clear out these guys first? I or think. Have Have any of them got range at the bottom? Uh, this one's got range. <coughs> this one's got range, and this one's got range. I think all the oh. melee dudes should take out that that dude at the top there. This this one. The range. Uh, no, the one the one outside of the cover. This one. And that will secure the bunker for the ranged people. Okay, so take out this guy. Ah, here. nice. Yeah. Okay, so what yeah, I will yeah. do then is move you this way, move you this way. Just, you know, every little helps. Right, let's go. Uh -huh. Fight. Let's go. Let's go. go. Randomia. What? Oh, what? Oh. What? What? This is Ooh. new. Uh, Randomia, the demoness, has taken an interest in our group's fate. She often elects individuals who are intellectually challenged, particularly unlucky or incredibly reckless as recipients of her blessings. Thanks to her, you now have access to the Rando Randomia influence gauge. It fills up uh, with every unlucky event or failure. It's the lucky dice. Yeah. 
Um, okay. Oh, awesome. So yeah, once a gauge fills up, we can use it. Stuff happens. Yay! Confirm. Wonderful. Okay, so uh, you want me to go after this bad boy first, right? Yeah. Um, so the way the combat works uh, is obviously tile-based movement, but you have two action points to use. Uh, you can use both on movement. Uh, so do a dash. You can attack. You can sprint as well. So, then... so this is regular movement. Um, but if I want to use both my actions to sprint somewhere to do double movement, then that's that gold box there. You see? Um, yeah. But yeah. the red means that he'll get an attack of opportunity if you yeah, move when you're in his threatened there. range. So oh, you can't cool. do that movement. Um, but the ranger is best when he is next to an ally who is about to attack. So I think get him into a position right next to this nerd. So I can only go about this far. Um, and then Conan's going next, and then the Paladins, so I could put oh, him actually, up here. Oh, actually, yeah, here. if you put him there, you can then use his charge ability to make everyone's Buff. Uh, attacks way so better. Sh shall I whack him here first to start with, and then get him to charge people up? Sure. See, I wanted you to play this, Tom, but you refused to install a voice meter. <laughs> no, I'm better at telling people what to do. Okay. Right. Charge! Oh, this yeah. is cool. Oh, right. he's now got the movement. Okay. To get whacking. Uh, so, hold on a minute. Uh, right click, there you go. Yeah. Off we pop. Yeah. And go, go, go. We Nail him. Gonna smash. We gonna smash. Yeah. Yeah. Bam. Okay. Oh, oh over. nice. Oh, yeah. She's not gonna get quite get there, but I can pop her. Does she, she have any like range? She what, looks what are like, her abilities? No, she's got no ranged ability. She's got le less lethal hammer of justice, so she can summon the hammer of justice to deal damage and stun. Uh, she's got lawful retaliation, so Paladin gains a huge bonus for her parry chance. Um, and then Jud Juddy Secure, a prayer to Jud Juddy that slightly uh, raises the protection of all allies in the area of its effect. So I could make a sprint over there, or I could pop a here-ish? Yeah, maybe if you put her in front of the ranger and then increase the parry chance? Okay. Just in case anyone shoots. Hey there, I'm the uh, ranger. I'm parry right. on her, though. Um, That's okay. So, anything you why see not? Will bite you why not? Here. If you can't attack. Got it coming down here. No, it's this boy's attack. Protect. You can't do nothing. Okay. You want me to smash this uh, thing, though, right? You want me to smash this up? Oh, you can. Perfect. Yeah. Break it down. Okay. Yeah. Bam. <laughs> Um, so cool. Nice. Do you want me to move to the other side so that he's? Kind of oh here? yeah, that's spooky as hell. Do that. Yeah. Okay. So and then he can face the dwarf. Awesome. <laughs> okay, that's his turn. Um, so you want? Do you want us me to move the rangers in, or do you want me to sh shoot this guy up and then? Go? I think they need to start moving. Yeah. Okay. I mean, I could do a magic arranged man. Oh no, I can't. I'm not within range. Uh, what's the oh, chance? I'm not within range. Am I not within? Um, so the wizardess as well has kind of big splash spells. So this is a whirlwind spell. Obviously, I'm not going to set it off now because like I will hurt more people. And she's also got cure as well. Um, but if we move, yeah, her I guess I guess nudge here. up and then yeah, or here about here. Or maybe here. maybe behind the cover of the box. Yeah. Because okay. uh, nice, yeah. ranged attacks also have a chance to, if they miss, they then have a chance to hit. Anything around I th it, so I think that's uh, only there's the a archer, chance. Archer, though, I think that's only the archer. Um, okay, yeah. well, uh, maybe maybe not the wizard then, but um, yeah. So there's a chance that the archer might hit the ogre. You don't want too many things in the way because she might just accidentally nail an ally. I'm gonna move the thief up. Thief, classically D and D as well. Um, if you can get like backstabs in and stuff like that, that's where he excels. Bingo. Um, nice. But yes, yeah, so it's going to be That's dwarf very turn cool. now. Oh, miss. Oh, Ooh, miss. Very Looking good. good. They can't they're do all anything. Are they? they couldn't. They can't. I'm not in range. They can't do shit. Um, oh, I'm surprised they're not just running up. I will shoot this guy. <laughs> Bam. Oh. Uh, nice. I'm going to move her here, I think. Just tuck her away a little bit. Yeah. yeah. So tuck her away. And then it's all big dwarf moves. Also, oh, when you were uh, with the rogue, by the way, that was good because you put him next to the ranger. Yeah. Um, so he gained a bonus. Oh, he's stunned now. Fuck. Oh, damn. That rude. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. oh, it's a backstab move. Ooh. It's fine. It's coming out again. Eight. Okay. Eight. Eight. It's fine. Oh, nice. That's fine. Um, here we go. Right. 
Oh, another backstab. Another paladin. <laughs> Boom! You, you parry. You parried. Bam! Boom! Nice. That's why. That's why I said it. That's boom, why. Boom! 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 Baby. Oh. Oh, okay, See, cool. Perfect. This is why you're better at XCOM than I am, because you do all the, like, buff moves, where I'm just the defensive moves, whereas I'm, I'm just like, attack, attack, attack. Oh, why is everyone dying? <laughs> uh, can the rogue get behind this dude? Rogue? Oh, no, uh, who is this? Oh, this is the rogue, So it's right? the ranger. No. Um, it's ranger time. Oh. It's ranger time. So ranger here, and then attack. Uh, yeah, what's it'll his third it'll ability? Boost, it'll boost um, the barbarian. Third ability is a heal. Uh, first aid. Oh, okay, cool. Um, so that's, ah, um, that's useful. So I want to move him, I think... Oh, I could move him here, and then the paladin can move up there. So if I move ranger uh, here, he, he will be more prone to attacks, though. Yeah, put him on... Yeah, put him there. And, uh, here? That, that place is good, yeah. Okay. Because otherwise the archers, the other here side, will start wailing on uh, him. And then just a standard attack, I think. Blam. Yeah. Boom. Awesome. Perfect. Uh, Thank God, they do have a lot of health. Yeah. Uh, Get the kill. Critical kill. hit. Yep. <gasps> Bam! Down. Oh, oh nice. 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 Oh, yeah. um, do we want to move the barbarian anywhere? Um, Maybe just turn him around. Don't turn around. Uh, so move there. Turn around there. So he's facing everybody. Uh, Paladin. Can't backstab. Paladin. Should we go for this guy? Oh, he's only on seven, though. I feel he's like also going. He's also going mega late, so you may as well yeah. have the paladin Go sort of something push else. the attack. Who do you want me to attack um, then? So we got one guy here, one guy here, one guy here, one guy here, one guy here. Maybe they uh, should take the northern path around the side to the crossbowmen, because those are the guys we want to take out first. This, um, these guys. No, the uh, the guy these on guys. the right. Yeah. So if you go up and around the pillar, maybe that's a good move. Uh, oh, you can't. Boxes it's blocked. Here, so I'd have to break them out. But I could move her up to like here. Uh, or um, actually, if I move her, hmm. see, if I put her there, I feel like everyone's going to go for her in the next go. But also, she does get another turn. So. Uh, so you, you could put her there and then put her on a defensive. Uh, yeah. Stance. stance. Yeah. Screw it. Let's see what happens. See what uh, happens. So put it there. Uh, so do, what do I have? I have protect. So that protection, everyone. But there's no one in my area. So I'll just defense her up. So we're going to put her in defense stance. Uh, this guy's going to move up. Have a whack. I'm oh, still hit, but had resistance. Didn't do much. Um, I feel like I kind of want to move my orc out. Start moving my orc out um, to smash maybe this bit here. What you do you can, think? You can charge just... down to that weird lantern thing in the middle. This one here? It does, does that give you protection? It does. I, yeah, that bit does. But only that way, not from these two guys here. So, Or I could go here. That's open to everyone is the thing. Yeah. What do you want, Tom? Um, Mega charge. Barley. Lantern. Lantern to here. I mean, he's going to get attacked by these guys, though. Oh, well, fine. Ah, it's just On your ogre. head, so be it. On your head. It's just an uh, What's up, Ree? Is Kim able to set a new donation goal? I'm not. Uh, no? If you go... Are you guys in the um, Discord, like the studio Discord? If you hit, like, at, if you go into the Yogs Discord and go at studio and go, can someone set a new donation goal, please? Um, then maybe studio will do that kindly. Maybe 1.7. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah that's... Chat, is, chat is suggesting 1696900. Four oh. two zero zero. Oh, sixty nine, sixty nine, four twenty. <laughs> chat, yeah, yeah, yeah. You are the best, chat. I love you, chat. Um, I'm just gonna blitz Ooh, this guy. Tom owes a dance as well, apparently. Uh, Nightjar promised Tom would dance. He hasn't danced, and now Tom is dead to the chat. <laughs> oh. <laughs> What? <laughs> Someone else promised something of me, and now I'm dead because I'm not. <laughs> I mean, I promised that you'd do this stream in the first place on this, the week of Cyberpunk, and you're here, so. <laughs> look, look, Tom, I mean... the ogre's almost dead because that what exactly what I said would happen is happening. I promise that for every 2p that is donated for this stream, Nightjar will match. 
Oh, <laughs> oh. I mean, look. Oh. <laughs> you can promise anything. <laughs> like a smile. <laughs> I can promise things too. Um, so I have an ability with the archer to do a ricochet <laughs> shot, which means I could hit two people, but I think I'm probably going to hit the orc and kill him. So let's just do a regular <laughs> shot, shall we? There we go. Um, Here we yeah. go. <laughs> Uh, is, are you guys able oh. to ask in um, studio? Because like, yeah, they'll, they'll, I don't have access to change the donation <laughs> reader, unfortunately. Um, I'll have a look. Yeah. Do I have oh, that thief to? is a goner. Um, I should have tried to do something to heal him, but I haven't. Um, I'm not feeling hey. too confident, guys. <laughs> hey, if you're new and you haven't uh, been watching the entire stream, this game is Dungeon of Nihilville. Um which is a game, uh, the publishers of this game has games in the bundle. Uh, so if you like the look of this game, then you won't be too far off finding similar games in the bundle. Also, we've already played Sunless Sea, which is awesome um, yeah. and is also in the bundle. The bundle? What? What's the bundle? Well, it's it? a December charity bundle. Donate to your favorite charities. Get a load of games for £25. <laughs> Jingle Jam dot tiltify.com like 40 plus games for 25 pounds or about 35 dollars super bad. super worth it um and some really amazing games in there too yeah so uh if you donate right now you'll get a load of games or... oh boy i set hit. myself up for a very mm. oh that was bad ignore it turns out they got a spinny move yeah it turns out um, i can spin also, we're in the midst of a 2p drive. Uh, so drive. If you if you have 2p spare, and I know you do. I should probably <laughs> heal, actually. Just look, donates 2p. Do you know how much money we'll raise? Take a guess. 5p? <laughs> I don't Yikes. know. I can't see chat right now. I don't know where we're at. Is, this, is the stream dead? <laughs> Hello. I think the uh -oh. stream might have just died. Oh no. Hello. Oh no. Uh, can you guys still hear me? Uh oh. Mm. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Hello. Is it, are we back? Fucked. Are we back? Gone. Hello? Hello? You're back? Hello? You're back? Hello? Oh my god. What, what's up? In the what's, what's happening? Oh, Tell me what's oh happening. God. What's happening? What do you mean what's happening? The entire dang stream died. Uh, are we back now though? I'm refreshing. Are we back? Oh, refresh right. everyone. I don't know why I'm saying Yeah, refresh. yeah. Do, do a refresh. Do it should be back refresh. now. refresh. We should be back. Don't Holy panic, Holy. children. Don't panic. Shh. Everyone's Look. panicking. When I said let's do a 2p drive, I wasn't expecting you all got everyone to do it, guys. You crashed <laughs> the internet. Oh my crashed god, the you internet. guys. You. you killed the internet just like in <laughs> 2008 when literally anybody did anything on the internet. <laughs> they killed the internet. You did it. Well done everybody. You did it. You killed charity. <laughs> just like Wreck it Ralph. Um, we're back now though, right? We're back. With that. If everybody, if everybody in this chat right now donates 2p, we'll have raised 90 pound. So you're looking at your 2p right now and thinking, wow, what a small amount of money. Well, that's how community works. Get donating, raise a huge amount of money for charity, even if it's just Whoops. 90 pounds, <laughs> which um. is a pittance compared to the uh, 1.685 million that has been raised. But Every little helps. Every little helps. Literally. It goes to so many good causes. 2P drive. 2P drive. 2P drive. 2P drive. I'm going to do something really risky here and probably kill my thief, but that's fine. Don't worry about it. Um, <laughs> don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Uh, don't worry backstab. About it. Activate. Bam. He's down. very dead. I've left him very op up in the open. Here we go. Goodbye to our thief. Here we go. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Ooh, two oh, two health. No. Two health. It's fine, Tom. It's fine. He's so dead. He's fine. Shh. Shh. Oh, no, um, no, 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 no. Oh, God. Okay. Uh, yeah, no, do that. That sounds awesome. Yeah. Do that. Do ricochet. I love it. You I, want me I love to do the ricochet, risk. Okay. But it might, it might hit someone I know. Love. I know. I know. 
I need um, it. I need it. Okay, here we go. It, it, yeah. If this kills the thief. Yep. No, <laughs> it hit the ranger. <laughs> it hit ranger. the ranger. It hit the ranger. Oh, no, okay. not the ranger. That's on you. If if the ranger now dies, oh goodbye, uh -oh. thief. Goodbye, thief. Oh, he's unconscious. Oh, good lord. He's unconscious. I'm okay. not playing this the most tactically. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. <laughs> I forgot oh. there was that guy there. I so he's on he Overwatch. There. That actually works. I think if you hover over the guy with Overwatch, mm -hmm. yeah, you All can see us. the range of it. So the ogre can actually just get round the back and just hit him and get rid of his Overwatch. Stealth ogre. I yeah. love it. Yeah. Yeah, we've got plenty of time, haven't we? Um, so However, it's what, the ranger's turn. What should I do with the ranger? Should I get rid of this uh, idiot here? Um, just a regular yes. attack. I could heal. I could heal the ranger, or I could get rid of this guy. What get rid of, yeah, getting rid of a guy. Get oh, rid. he's the first on the list as well, so that's good. Okay. Uh, nice. Oh, oh my god. Oh, he took damage himself. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, hold on. We're he went gonna... to swing and he swung around and hit himself. <laughs> right. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna do this. Can I do this? How do I do this? Do this. Uh, do this. Okay. Okay, so I, I invoked the right of Randomia, and I just did a big a big heal. A big heal. Nice. Um, I'm going to stay here and, and carry on. There we go. Uh, right. Okay. What can I do now? Can I... Hmm. Oh, I can hit. Yeah, okay. We're going to whirlwind. Um, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, yeah, that way. Okay, it's good. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry. <laughs> yeah, it was going to hit the thief to begin with. Oh, what oh, the hell? <laughs> So Conan's a twat. It's Sunday rolls. Uh, <laughs> yeah, this is the high rollers. This is the high rollers. Garen damn T. <laughs> right. If you don't die, hold on. Can I do a big? Can I do a big? Oh, that's that's a one hundred percent to do twenty six damage. So that will one hundred percent kill him. But that's a seventy seven. Screw it. We need some yeah, hundos. Yeah. Go for the hundo. We need a hundo. <laughs> what Shit, the? Fighting like a lettuce eater. Oh my lord. <laughs> <laughs> this game is great. <laughs> This game is <laughs> Oh my Unbelievable. god. Unbelievable. Well, they missed as well. Good. <sighs> uh, it was this guy Overwatch, wasn't Incredible. it? Okay. Here we go. Right, I'm going to smash this guy with my tum. Yes. Uh, that's Revenge. What gonna do. Oh, 65 chance of hitting, though. 70% chance of hitting with this. Nice. Do yeah. it. Get the crit. Tom. Body wants <laughs> <laughs> Um, <laughs> right, does anyone... I mean, the thief needs healing, but I don't know... Oh, I don't have any heals, actually. Uh, can I hit with this? Uh, uh, no, I want to hit... No, I don't want to hit that area. I want to hit just these maybe, two. Maybe just maybe just do a movement first. Yeah, okay. Um, I didn't expect there to be just this mega combat happening around here. Um, right. I'm gonna move, that's good. I'm going to move her out of cover here. Yeah, screw yeah that it. works. Time for a risky business. Um... There we go. I'm going to go for these two. Bam. Yeah. Oh, a lot of damage, but still guaranteed. Still damage, though, innit? It's still yeah, exactly. damage. Whoa. Whoa. It's still up. damage. What's going on? Oh, they got a great oh, failure against now us. You, and yeah. almost killed himself, too. Nice. Now you are the one who stabs yourself. <laughs> Conan. No, Conan's all right. Conan's all right. Conan's fine. Um, yeah. Right. Can I? Ricochet! I can't ricochet. It's uh, still uh, um, charging oh, yeah. back up. But I can Ooh, get this kill. guy. There we go. Bang. Perfect. Good night. <laughs> right. Wonderful. Okay. It's all right. It's, okay. it's going all right. I'm going to keep her here, though, I think. Yeah, keep her there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, right. Okay, oh, who's so this nerd? Got one, two, three. We've got four of them left. Oh, he's four on Overwatch left. again. Okay. This That's guy all right, is... though. He's right next to Ogre. <laughs> Ow, he kicked me in the nads. Kicking the Ogre. He kicked me. In my bits, yeah. in my tingly bits. 101% to kill this guy. Right, good night. <laughs> Thank oh, you. nice. Thank you. So satisfying. Um, it is very satisfying, yes. Uh, if I... I think I'm all right here. Uh, I don't think there's any... You can't, you can't move because of the overwatch. Yeah. So uh. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to move. I'm going to stay here. I've turned my back, though, like a twat. That's <laughs> fine. We all get mixed clicks sometimes. Um, seventy cent chance of hit. Screw it, we're going. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. Oh, here yeah. we go. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Dead. Perfect. I love it when the the tide t t the turn of tides tide. 
the turntables. The turn tides. The, the turn turntables. Tables. Yep. <laughs> uh, right. I his Overwatch is there, but that's fine. I'm gonna go up to. Oh, he is gonna get an attack of opportunity on me though. If I go screw up, screw it. Go for yeah? it. Yeah, screw it. Yeah, just get get all up in his business. Okay, yeah. Let's get, get up in his business. Come on, shoot me. What are you gonna do? Kill me? Oh, he missed. Twat. Oh yes. Twat. Um, and then we're gonna go for a bog standard slap. <laughs> Bang. Nice. Oh. That was a nice hit. Uh, we're gonna go for a slap on you, a little bit of slap and tickle on you. 60% on that. Oh yeah, no. Push him. I think the push will do damage when he hits the wall. It's 65% though, chance of hit. I know, but imagine. Okay. <laughs> Belly, he dodged. He oh, dodged. Nice. He dodged, Tom. He dodged. He, he dodged. He, he, he dodged. I just wanted to hit him against the wall. Okay. I know, I know you like that ability. Um, I do. Right, we're up gonna up move our wizard over here. Because I think yes. it's safe nice. for him to pop out now. Uh, yeah. We're going to do a little Eldritch Blast. Eldritch Blast! <laughs> Poof! Dead. Oh, cool. Nice. One um, dude left. Oh, what was thief, that? Thief. Oh, he's just thinking about things. Don't worry about him. Uh, don't worry about him. He's got one turn to get him back. He, now, can uh, we kill... Oh, hang on. Has he got literally until the end of the ranger's turn? Hold on a minute. So... Oh, that was I a could... sprint. Oh, I sprinted. Twat. What a twat. Oh well, it's fine. That what a waste okay. of a turn! What a waste of a turn, you silly dwarf. You could have you could have nutted me then and you didn't. Um Oh, first aid him, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay. yeah. Wonderful. Chicken magic. Oh nice. Up he gets. As Boom. as typical, Thief spends the entire battle on his ass. Um where oh, do that I was go? a powerful heal. I wanna go here. I wanna face this. I will um, say, I'm gonna sword the, you. Don't overdo it. this is probably the only game I've played where the healing feels very bad. Yeah, yeah. Um, actually healing. Ta -da! 56 damage! Did it! Awesome! Good job! Victory! Ba -ba -ba! Ba -ba -ba -ba! Hey, level ups all round. Yeah, level up. Uh, level up everyone as well. Take all yeah, the, back! So uh, when, you, when people awesome. go unconscious in combat, they gain well, injuries, Warren. which are like permanent effects until you Didn't heal them. You yeah. um, so the rogue would have had a debuff there yeah, that would have been like, oh, you yeah. busted your leg or something. Yeah. Um, Very cool. Right. Hey, he's back. Like I had a feeling that that evil a dwarf was our dwarf, but he put the amulet ah, on and he turned evil. The curse by oh, the, the amulet chaos. Oh. He picked up this cheeky amulet and he turned evil. I must say, I misjudged you. Very cool. Then maybe you'd like but to then team now up. we have a paladin We're in the team. Yay! Yeah. Really yeah. Gotta collect the bounty. So is it? Awesome. Do you now have to choose we'll talk about your a party? Because the party the meantime, is getting big. Like Possibly. Really big. Let's see. I'm going to skip blah, 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 blah. Skip, skip, skip. Okay, yeah. So it looks like she's waiting in the um, the bar. So I guess if we want to like tinker with our with our party, we can go back there. Go back to the VIP room. And uh, change our party up. So there we go. Cool. So that is a quick little look at Dungeon of. N Real quick. N N Sorry. Yep. What what is the co-op room on the map? The co-op room. Oh. Isn't that um the bar like the tavern area? Oh. The VIP room. Okay. Yeah. I just don't know why it's called co-op. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh. no, I, th I think it's Ooh. really, really cool. And I think it's one of those things where, yeah, it feels a little bit XCOM light, but mm -hmm. in the same way as Mario Rabbids felt like XCOM light, and that was amazing. <laughs> um, mm -hmm. Like, it's it's got all the right stuff there. There's some really cool little things that are different to XCOM, obviously being fantasy. Um, but, like, if you start your turn, don't use any actions and go into Overwatch, then you have two shots instead of one. Pretty cool. Things yeah. like that. Just things like that. Also with the ogre, if you push away from someone when, when they're next to someone, they get an attack of opportunity and take the damage from the push and take the damage from hitting a wall or something. So you can do some really cool, powerful combos in this game. And I, I'm, I'm looking forward to playing some more. Also skill tree, also equipment that makes your character look cooler, mm -hmm. gives them mm -hmm. new things. Mm -hmm. um, and There's yeah, um... it's also apparently an audio podcast adventure thing. In yeah, French. yeah. <laughs> so, really sure. Cool. And thank you um, to the publishers for um, donating games to the the Jingle Jam bundle as well. 
Um, yeah. So, yeah. yeah. So, what are we going to do now? Now it's Rhiannon's time to shine. Oh, my God. Da, it's da, 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 da. Right, let me just quit out of this so you don't hear the uh, muse art. Also, Nightjar, if you're listening, I know you're probably sending me loads of furious messages on uh, Discord, but I can't look at them because, as you can see, these nerds are here via Discord, so I can't check Discord. Um so uh -oh. message Tom instead. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. What's happening? Uh oh. Uh -oh. Ted, are you online? Stream's dying. Stream's dying. It's fine. It's back. Oh. It's uh -oh. back. Right. It's fine. It's back. Nice. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about sure. it. Uh Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We're so what we? Re, you're so, going to play one uh, now, aren't you? I am. I am. We're going to be playing Transistor. Whoop -a -boop. Yeah, Which made by Super Giant Games, the same dudes that made Hades. Probably yeah. my game of the year. Yeah. Uh, and you can tell. Hold on a minute. Ted, can you stop downloading porn? I mean, char we're doing charity here. Milo. We're yeah. It's not Milo. Milo doesn't have access to the iPad. He chewed the wires. He chewed the wires. Well, can you stop Milo from chewing the wires, please? Ted, please. Um, also, Ted, we reached, our, we reached our target. Do you want to say anything to the children? Um, so, uh, Ted just did a thumbs up and said congrats, but like, con hey. congrats, like, like, Tom, Tom, you need to, <laughs> you need to get Tash in and, and ask, to give her a, like, you know, what's her reaction to, to the fact All that right. we hit a target? Like, we, I think we need to complete the trifecta of underwhelmed, sure. um, partners. Like we've reached, we've got 1.685 million pounds ted so much um so, very so, generous so, so yeah did she just say to piss off tom <laughs> what? she's asleep because she's very ill oh <laughs> and bless. you woke her up oh i'm sorry Cha no, charity no, woke, she, her woke her up charity woke her up <laughs> charity yeah. Char char wow. charity charity uh, right. Well done, everyone. Well Let's done. Bring up. You woke yeah. Tash up when she was ill. Now you're going to have to donate more two penny coins to make up for this. Right. That's Let's what she said on her deathbed. On her deathbed. She, on her death <coughs> she, said, she said, I wish everybody would uh, donate 2p to the Jingle Jam. Uh, or there one it is. pound. That would be even there, better. It there it is. Awesome. Okay, see, I can, I can do technology. We, <laughs> we have Transistor. Woo! So Love this it. is in the bundle. This is in the bundle. Um, so, yeah. Rhiannon, you are taking the wheel. Hello. Jesus, take the wheel. Do you see it? I'm in the game, but hey, it look. looks like it's on the menu screen. Our overlay, our overlay has um, are, are updated. Yay. Yay. Oh, so the goal is now... Got it. Uh, it's not 16969420. It's now 16904269. Oops, hold so, on. So uh, just okay. over, or oh, just under 5,000 away, and you can get to 16942069. Awesome. Right. Awesome. So, here we go. Is that working? It's working in bursts. There we go. Yeah. There we go. There it's we all go. right. So, this is so this made. Game. So, this is made by the people who've made Hades, is that right? Yeah. Yes. Uh, as well as Pyre and Bastion. Um, so if you've played any of those games, they are incredible. Um, yeah. I haven't played Pyre. I haven't played this one, actually, either. So what is this progress? You're just trying to whack this dude. So, yeah, we're just trying to take out this guy. How close to the start is this, by the way? This is just this is the beginning. This is the very start of the game. Oh, OK. But this so game is... tells you nothing. It doesn't tell you anything. Yeah, what's that one and two? Is that what you're using to attack? Yeah. It's so basically you've got your skills at the bottom, and then you just go around and you discover things about the world, the story. It literally just put you. Just, you start blind, basically. Okay. Kind of like Hades. And it's also turn-based. If you want it to be turn-based, which is really fun. Oh really? Yeah. Oh. So you can go like this and go bam. I want to do that, and then I'm gonna press space again. Or undo it's because it's tutorial. Okay, and then we'll bam, 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 bam. 
go, okay, what are you doing, game? Please, let me let me go this way. No, let me go this way, please. Am I right in thinking well, that, that that sword is talking? We have we have a talking yes, sword so in this. Oh. The sword is sentient. <laughs> cool. You know how I feel about sentient swords. Let me let me there we go. Can I can I do what is it doing? Okay. Please go. Yes. Now I wanna do this. Yes. And now I'm gonna go here. And then I'm gonna smick it again. There we go. So that's the turn base. What? And this blue bar at the top it charges your uh, your turn base. So you can't just like spam it. Oh, I see. So it's not you don't make the entire game turn based. You just basically no. stop the game so you're able to do these mega combos. So breach exactly, is one of your movements. Yeah. Two breaches, oh. bam, and okay, I get it. I get it. Now I'm into that. Good. I'm very yeah. into that. Guys, the sun is trying to. Blind me! I'll just sit yeah. here in the dark. Don't yeah, the sun. <laughs> the sun. What is this? Yeah, Tom, you like to sequester yourself in a room of complete darkness, don't you? Well, no, the problem is that this window is, is, is like pointing at the sun. It really blows out the camera. It's for right. your benefit, everyone. For your, but you don't want to see uh, Tom in his true form. Uh, yeah. Right. While uh, Re plays this, I want to read out a couple of donations because uh, we have a hundo from Minimer. Uh, who says, keep up the good work. Also, I loved seeing Sunless Sea. I forgot how much I enjoyed that game. Um, yeah, we really also cool. have £200 donation from S. Mitchell 86 and direct to 125. Thank you, S. Mitchell 86. That's insanely, insanely generous. Uh, any more? No. Well, uh, I'm just, I'm just, I'm, I'm looking at the uh, donation reader for the first time, and I've never used it. So I'm like, how, how does one click this? Uh, clear, uh. clear to sort time, there sort amount. Uh, how, how? Clear to 11am, there we go. Uh, Tom, why don't you tell us about the amazing things you can donate towards? Oh, I see. Uh, yeah, where's my mouse gone? There it is. <laughs> <coughs> so, through the jingle jam .com, you can donate to specific causes that take yeah. your fancy. For example, but not limited to, the uh, Mental Health Foundation, which improves the well-being of gamers by funding groundbreaking research, which is very important. Mental health, especially during 2020. Um, it's, without uh, overstating it, it's in the toilet. Yep. So uh, we need to bring it back, make people more aware of uh, solutions, ways to fix it, also awareness. Um, mm -hmm. A lot of people just don't even consider it to be a thing until someone Brain's says, no, look, power. these are the telltale signs that this is a problem and these are the ways that we can fix it. People don't know Warm that it's afflicting them place. and they don't know that there are ways to solve it. Um, Where were we? It might not be the norm. Watch it out. might be something that you can very easily fix and that's Mental Health Foundation. Special Effect uh, are planning to fund two brand new games with eye gaze, which again, as I said at the start, is a way to get everybody playing games uh and yeah. as the chat said even if they don't want to um <laughs> yeah, uh, war child uk war child uk they are very close actually to their 200,000 goal uh supporting 3,150 vulnerable children affected by war okay, that's a lot 3,150 yeah. and they are very close to their goal very um, very close yeah uh ILGA uh, are also extremely close to their goal of 200,000, which is to train 60 activists to support bisexual, intersex, trans women and youth. And yeah, very important as well. ILGA are a really good organization. Um, obviously, Hat Films and I did a big um, charity drive towards them a few years ago. Um, and yeah, they in they invited us out to one of their um, international conferences out in Thailand to kind of give a talk on, um, you know, how how to raise money using Twitch. And that was an amazing experience. And they, they do a lot of good work. And in kind of um, talking to the organizers and the people who kind of very kindly invite us out there and sitting in on a lot of the talks that they held, like they are serious about their work. You know, they, they really are a good organization that are passionate about bringing um, 
LGBTQ rights internationally, you know, fighting for rights in countries where currently being gay is a crime, um, you know, which is which is wrong. And, and ILGA are going into these countries to lobby against this, to change these laws so that yeah. people can just be people, you know? Um, so, yeah, it was ILGA... Only a couple of days ago, it was Bhutan. Bhutan, think, yeah. That only, only a couple of days ago uh, decriminalized it. Yeah. Tw it's 2020. My 2020, dudes. yeah. <laughs> so, um, um, yeah, Ilga do such amazing work. Um, obviously, 125, that's my charity of choice. Um, they help uh, women who face street sex work in Bristol. They um, help bring them in off the streets, give them the help they need, give them counselling, legal help, you know, help them kind of find a new house, help them find a job. You know, even something as simple as, like, so the drop-in centres, which um, your money will fund, will fund a year of um, of, uh, of a drop-in centre being open. Um, it's a place where these women can go in any time of the day or night um, and get a hot meal, get some help, get someone to listen to them, to talk to. Um, which I think you know is so very important because I think, I think it, I think it's one of those things, right? We say sex work, and I, I know a lot of people will be like, hee 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 hee, she said sex, um, but this is this is very serious because a lot of people who end up in sex work do because they come from a place of trauma. Um, you know, a lot of them are victims of um, sexual abuse, domestic abuse, child abuse. You know, and are kind of driven to these roots um, to have to survive. So. 125, I think, is a very important organisation to help give these people, give these victims, you know, the, the empathy that they need and a chance, a chance to just live a normal life. So that's that's the cause that kind of is close to my heart. Um, but yeah, we've got yeah. a few more, uh, a, f a fair few more donations coming. We got 40 quid from uh, Game and Inc. Says so many worthy courses, how to choose, and happy pre-birthday, Kim. <laughs> Thank you, Game and Inc. Uh, thank you as well to, uh, I think we got up to Livid Silver, uh, to Pauline, to Djarling Wizard, to Billy Jennings, to David, to Osmian O's, to Proki Papi, who says, save the dolphins, please. Um, and thank you to Bobo, who says, hi, Rollers, I'm addicted to your D&D campaigns. Rip Grundle. <laughs> Grundle, oh my god, that was such a long time ago. Holy crap. Grundle, that is that is a blast from the yeah, past. Yeah, that's a um, good reference. Yeah, we've got a message going, uh, 2p drive for the win from Matt, who actually donated £10, so uh, there you go. Um, we thank you to Defects, to... Uh, Defects, hey! <laughs> hey! Nice. Thank you to the Sharpie Pen, who donated £30 and said, here's 1,500 2ps that should co cover a couple of people. There you go. <laughs> So yeah, thank you to Namas, to Drool Waifu, to Stabface, okay. uh, to Stevania, to Matthew Trowell. Epic gamers play epic games for epic charities. Thank you to Evo, to Gibby Gibby Gibson. I love these names that are coming in, guys. Like, Gibby Gibby Gibson. Gibby Gibson. Gibby Gibson. Gibby Gibson. But yeah, keep your donations oh. coming in. Ree, how are you doing with Transistor? Is it doing really good? Oh, no. <laughs> I love it. It's so much fun. I love games where they don't give you any story straight up they just drop you straight in so you're left to figure things out for yourself it's great and it's it's very hades feeling like it's that whole the whole art style is very reminiscent of hades the, the combat I feel like hades is, nice. is very fast paced though i know a lot of people have turned yes. down hades because the game's hard the game is very hard um, it is hard this is, and this is it's, yeah, it's a slow, this is a slow sort of paced game for sure. But I feel like yeah, there's a lot that. you can do at certain times to just really change it up. Like yeah, like you just got this dash ability. What is it? Yeah. Bam, bam, bam. But then like this is like the turn based makes it so much fun to just stack up loads of combo moves. Yeah. Well, this looks really cool actually. So are those your four abilities? so far or have you swapped them so out far or? yeah you can you can get upgrades for them as well and give them different um power bonuses you can give them different abilities um can which you is really really cool do they also individually like have do they cause debuffs that mean that other things do more power like um, is yeah, there so a certain combo are... thing so you've got like Ones that are good for short range, and then you have moves that are good for long range, and ones that do like AOE effects too. So they all like do different things. Yeah. So this okay. is uh, so this is now like the skill tree, like a little bit of a skill tree option. You get to pick oh. um, different abilities to add to your 
um, main attacks. So the bounce will bounce off enemies. It will like be like a chain effect. It will bounce from one enemy to the next, which is really cool. And then okay. uh, mask is like a concealing shot, which is really fun. But I like I like bounce. I'm just gonna turn our cams off so you can see that a little bit more detail. There you go. All uh, right. Ooh. There you go. Bang, we're back. <laughs> I'm just checking. I, cool. I just realized that our target is 169042269. Yeah. So whoever's in studio heard our pleas. They heard our pleas. And we're 78% there, guys. Can we can we hit this by in like, what What have we got? We've got 40 minutes-ish? 40 minutes to Let's do 4,100-ish. Tom, your math ability <laughs> just blows my mind. Like anyone who knows high rollers knows that I cannot. Four thousand and sixty-six, uh, to be precise. Uh, Four thousand and sixty-sixty-five pound eighty-seven. What can we, what chat, what can we do to, to incentivize you to reach this goal? What things, what things shall we do if we hit this target? You know. Like what? What? What do you want? Do, I mean, Tom said he was going to dance, but didn't. <laughs> I didn't say I was going to dance. Would you dance though for for the memes? You don't want to see it. You don't want to see it. Oh, we do though, <laughs> clearly. No, you don't. Trust me, you don't. You don't. Um, you don't want like. Uh, you're probably thinking right now. Oh, I'm not that bad a dancer. And then you'll see me dancing. You'll think, oh fuck, I'm actually terrible at dancing. That's fine. But that's what the children want. That's what they want. Lots of people want Tom dancing. Uh, someone said show cat. Milo does not like being picked up, and if he's out, that's it. I can't. I can't promise that. An Ellie dance? Can you make Ellie dance? Is, is, is your yes? Your okay. Cat? Yeah. All right. Okay. There you go. If 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 we get four thousand one hundred pounds, four thousand and forty pounds in the next thirty minutes, then absolutely <laughs> I will go get the cat and dance. <laughs> Oh, uh, okay. So, th so that's the thing that will happen. So, um, there's three thousand eight hundred of you in chat. So let's say like one pound fifty, one pound fifty. Um, that'll cover it. More, you can do it. I mean, that's it and a bit more, isn't it? Like, I, know, bit I, know, over, I know I've just yeah. triggered your math brain there. <laughs> no, if 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 all three thousand eight hundred of you donate a hundred pounds, we might make, reach the target. Oh yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. Hold on. <laughs> One pound three p drive. One pound do it. Three p. <laughs> you you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Um, we got um, uh, we got some money in from Phil, who says I've been sent here by Spiff. Oh, Bill Common. <laughs> Welcome. Uh, thank you as well to Believer, who says here's my early birthday gift to you, Kim. Keep up the good work and a merry bar humbug to all three of you. Thank you. Merry bar humbug to you too, Believer. Um, oh. But yeah, I may have missed some messages. Like I, I appear to be missing a whole bunch of messages. Um, Re? Re? Yeah. There you go. I get it. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. Oh, that was looking bad. It's all good. It's Re? all good. Don't, don't, don't you worry about it. Don't you worry about it. Everything is fine. It's all good. This guy's gonna get. This guy's gonna go. But we're over killing them just to make sure. There we go. Oh yeah. So, um, did you guys see the ISP stream last ne night where ISP basically, if you donated, you could spin this wheel and um, he could do things to Bo who was playing um, Hearts of Iron, and he could do things like de uh, delete his um, delete his like uh, troops and change borders and blah 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 oh, blah. Oh right. But one of the um, re rewards on the wheel was basically Bo destroying one of his anime figurines. <laughs> really cool. Oh, so no. um, we've got a message in chat that if Bo can destroy one of his anime figurines, Tom, you can you can dance. <laughs> you can dance if you want to. You can do it. Uh, I was just trying to think if there's something for me to destroy. <laughs> um, how about um. Your copy of Cyberpunk. <laughs> Digital copy, baby. Free. Got a refund. <laughs> oh, it was a thousand pound donation goal for the for the figurine. So that that's a big that's a big wow. that's a big ask. Tom Tom works for less though. It's fine. Tom works for less. I like what? it all. Yeah, I mean, but Bo that's Bo right. liked his Bo liked his uh, figurine. Tom, that was sometimes. Yeah, but what figurine was it though? It was an anime figurine. I don't know which which yeah, anime. But, uh, 
Yeah, that's what? the thing. It could be like I don't know, something ones? bad, you know. Yeah. Was it was it just like a Pokemon? Was it just a Pikachu figurine that you could? Because that's technically an anime, and that's technically a figurine. So it could just be like you know, just a little Pika Pikachu thing. It was Marie from Girl and Panzers. Girl and Panzers. Uh, okay. <laughs> Is there literally an anime where it's just girls and panzer tanks? Is that it? It, it was really rare and he brought it back from Japan. Oh my wow. God. Girl and Panzers. <laughs> It's a sports Incredible. anime about tanks. Wow, today I learned. <laughs> today I learned, everybody. <laughs> Tom, what's your right. thoughts? <laughs> Man, no, I mean, uh, I, I, I'll be honest. When someone says anime girl, I immediately think of something very different. Uh, but no, what? she actually seemed like... <laughs> she seemed... Pretty, pretty uh, I mean, you know, I mean, I'm like, sorry, can we go back to that? Yeah, let's elaborate on this a bit I mean, more like, this. What is I mean, like, you know, extremely breasty. Extremely. Like, uncomfortably so. Um, but no, you know what? She actually seemed like a decent character from an anime that I will never watch. Okay. Can the girl turn into a panzer? Right. Is that, is That's that an, an anime? important question. Can the girl turn into a panzer? Does the panzer turn into a girl? Is it, is the girl actually a tank? Is, is that? No. Oh, well, I'm not interested then. They operate the tanks. Boring. Boring. Okay. Boring. Uh, thank you to Hiptech for donating towards the two pence drive for cat dance. Uh, we've also got a donation from Kazos who says, Tom, come on, do the dance. Come on. It's good. Forget about it. Dance. Forget about it. What's he doing? Forget oh, about look. it. We've got got Tom on screen. Where's That's he fine. going? Where's he going? Don't get us cancelled, Tom. What's he doing? Is he actually gonna? Oh no, Tom! What are you doing? Okay. You, no, okay. no. If we get to two million in the next twenty-five minutes, I'll eat Quill. Two million no. in the next twenty minutes. Come on, Jeff Bezos, jump in! I'll eat Quill. <laughs> You'll eat <laughs> He'll Quill. Do it. Will you do it with, ke uh, uh, with ketchup? You know, some sauce? No. No? I'll, Dry? I'll go raw on quill. You'll go raw on quill? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> um, it's only 210,000 pounds to hit that target. Yeah. So, um... We can do it. Yeah. I mean, look, I'm going to be eating something that's filled with wires. Uh, I want to see this boy chow down on a bird. Make it happen. <laughs> <laughs> Kentucky Fried Quill. Why not? Why not? What if it um, actually happened, though? Imagine. Imagine if we actually hit two, two milli in, like, the next five minutes. I think the I'd single retire. Largest, single largest donation in Jingle Jam history. Uh, and it's so that I eat... A bird, a, a metal bird. Yeah. Do, does anyone have Elon? Uh, does anyone have Elon's number or Turn Jeff Bezos's number? Does Does anyone know any rich Don't people? To be honest, the richest person <laughs> I know is um, Lewis. So. <laughs> <laughs> <What>? I mean, <laughs> does sure. anyone have Lewis's number? <laughs> or that. Um. Wow! For the first time. Uh, ever, I think we've had the person on stream saying "Call Lewis" before chat. <gasps> yeah, I, oh. yay! I, I I did it, chat. I did it. Um, we have had a donation from Thirty Nine Salty Cookies who says, "I'm here from Cats and Dancing, not necessarily in that order." Uh, or death. And a message from Toe. Order. A donation and a message from Toe. So someone's Toe has donated. Um, oh. I've watched for years, and this is the first time I've had money to donate. Merry Christmas. Thank you very Aww, much. Thank you. Well, Merry Christmas. Merry Kimbus. Merry Kimbus. Merry Kimbus. Merry Kimbus. Everyone. Dun dun. Ooh. I really need a wee, yeah. wee guys. I, I really need a wee. I just. Go. <laughs> yeah. We're just watching. Uh, we're just watching Transistor at the moment. You gotta do nothing. Yeah. 
Oh, it was, I've had to do things for the last two hours. I get a break now. I can. I can yeah, that's what I'm saying. We haven't actually on, taken on. a break this entire time either. Yeah. No. So you head off. No do breaks you, for us. Do you want to? Oh. There's no no time for breaks. I created a break no. stream at, at screen and everything as well. Um, ah, so. it's fine. Yeah. You run off. You okay. run off. Are you guys yeah. gonna say no, mean things dead. about me while I'm not that's here? No, we're gonna Why? say nothing the entire time. It's no, gonna be silent. You can't do that. Silent. You need to be entertained. Guys, this is a thing. <laughs> they let us on the main channel. They sent me the stream key and everything. We can't let the children Wait, down. we're on the main. We're streaming right now? Yes! Oh my god. I thought we were just hanging Jesus out in this book. Why do you let me know? <laughs> I made a fool of the myself. Life? I alluded to hentai earlier. Jesus! <laughs> This is my <laughs> reputation. It's in ruins. There's 4,000 people watching you right now, Tom. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I hope my I hope my mum's not watching. Oh no. Oh my god. There's so many messages. So many messages. Tom, stop speaking. Tom, stop speaking. <laughs> Tom, you've embarrassed me, Tom. Tom, you're written out the, the family world. name. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyway, en enjoy your pee. Okay, I will. Uh, um, don't don't Your say pee, mean pee, things pee, pee. Me. You you take you, you take the wheel. Jesus, take the wheel. She's um, sweet. Hey. Reed. Hey. Hey Tom. Welcome. Welcome. Bill Common, hello. Kim, you know what I mean? And and she great. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. She's the best. One of my Oh, favorites. this thing's gonna kill me. Stop. That's gonna destroy Stop. you. Stop. Stop. Hey. 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 Turn base, please, and kill this thing. <laughs> there we go, he's dead. This? Wonderful. No, it's not. Ah, turn base, turn base, turn base, turn base, turn base, turn base, turn base. Why did it survive? Dash or something. Press 4. It uses up my turn base ability. Oh, really? Wait, yeah. what? Yeah. Because it, it costs Oh, you've got magic. a death defiance thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, just. Oh, my God. I've, I've lost one of my moves. No! Oh my god, kill it! I'm trying! Kill it! Okay, I think this is it. I think this will do it. Oh, thank Christ. Cool. Right, hey. Look, hey. At, look, at, look at this guy. Simon Honeydew has just raided <gasps> Hello. the channel as well. In prep for, in 20 minutes, in 20 minutes, if you're 20 wondering minutes. what is next after this stream, uh, you have to look forward to the Yogscast game jam. <gasps> with... oh! Yeah, it's really, really cool. There was one last year. It was very cool. There were some amazing games that were made. This time we've got Ben, Matt Castle, Red Guy, and I think Chris Yules is joining as well. Um, oh, sweet. Who are going to be playing through all of the games that were made for the Yogscast game jam bundle. Uh, oh, very and there exciting. are a lot. There was tons. Tons and tons and tons and tons and tons this time around. I think last year maybe it may have just broken 100. I think there's like 250 this time. Um, wow. So awesome. I'm back. that's going to be really cool. Over 200 submissions Hello. for the game jam. And uh, yeah, you'll be able to see the judging on that next uh, in the next stream. Craig. Uh, the winners of which get some really, really cool, um, really, really cool uh, prizes including tutorials on how to be a full-time game dev and stuff like that. It's awesome. Very um, cool. And obviously, I'm a big fan of that because Pitch Please, there's a promo for you. <laughs> um, we've, um, <clears throat> we've had a raid from Simon as well. Welcome, yeah, way Simon, ahead of you. people. Way ahead of you. Oh, Hello. We did, that, we did that in between the moment of us uh, shit-talking you. Um, I'd also, while you were shit-talking me, I'd like to... Uh, update everyone in that I've yes. turned my shirt around. I'm now, <laughs> Done. I'm she now correctly it. dressed. Um, well it's almost two o'clock and I'm correctly dressed for the day. So, <laughs> How is it almost yeah. two already? Jesus. I know, right? Um, it's flying by. I turn Man. 36 next week and <laughs> I've Happy just birthday. learned how to dress myself. <laughs> Speaking of turning 36 next week, is there going to be some kind of event, some live stream perchance, in which you can celebrate your birthday with everybody in chat, Kim? No. Okay, cool. Well, in that <laughs> case, you do have Sunday to look forward to oh, when us three are going to be back for High Rollers, the Christmas yeah. special. What's um, it going to be? I have no idea what Mark has planned, actually. I have no. zero idea. 
Um, but the High Rollers Christmas special will be live there. If you haven't watched High Rollers before and you want to see what it's like, this is, I think we're going with the same approach as normal, where it's canon unless someone dies. Um, I think. I don't know. That's cool. I just love everyone sharing me in chat for getting dressed correctly. Um, hey. No one cheers note, yeah. me when I dress correctly. This is bullshit. Well, you're not going senile yet. Um, I will be doing a birthday stream. I'm just um, narrowing down what day it's going to be because um, we have a few co uh, schedule conflicts. So my birthday's on Tuesday and I was going to do a giant Among Us game. Um, but there's a few schedule conflicts so we're just working it out. So the stream will either be Monday, Tuesday or Wednesday. <laughs> It'll be one of those days. <laughs> um, so, but yeah, there, w there will be a birthday stream uh, happening. However, Thomas Hazel, we have a big half hundo. Have you already read this out? Half hundo? H half thousand -o. Um yeah. From Recall. Wait, who hang says, on, sorry. So, wait, hey, so 500? Yeah. Okay. Half thousand -o. All right, that's half very different to a half hundo. Yeah. Half thousand -o, uh, From Recall. Okay. Who says on behalf Again. of those in chat that can't donate, let's hit that hashtag go raw on quill goal. <laughs> <laughs> That's incredible. I love I it. I mean sure. What a what a goal name. Recall Thank you yet again for your insane continued generosity. Um, yeah. God but, damn. But please don't hashtag go yourself. raw on quill. Yeah, hashtag go raw on quill. Will, will you do it if if they hit two milli in general? God, no. No, we did say no. the next 20 minutes, didn't we? No, because there's a chance, you know? <laughs> <laughs> there is and a chance. Didn't, didn't a fan make that as well? Uh, a fan make what? The Quill Doll. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, I mean, I, I, I figured what's better than destroying an anime figure that you like? eating a fan-made uh, quill doll that you really like. It's quite a yeah. big doll as well. It's quite big. It's big. It, it would be It would be a dinner. Yeah. Mm. A Sunday dinner? With some roasties? Uh, would I roast it first? That's a good question. Mm. Mm. It is made of fur. Well, you've got to marinate it. Mm. You have to. I'd have to, yeah. I mean, it's, it's, yeah, it's yeah. metal and fur. Um... <laughs> Could I could I marinate it in like a spaghetti bolognese? Oh yeah 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 yeah. Oh, I do. And like it's spaghetti, a, bolognese. spaghetti bolognese has just got a chopped up metal quill on the inside. Let it soak overnight, you know. Get real mushy. Get ready to yeah. Oh. What are you guys gonna have? Oh, for you lunch? know what? I'm really hungry. I'm actually looking forward to this now. Yeah. <laughs> so people have 15 minutes to hit two milli, and and then I'll, re I'll reduce it. the goal then. If we get to 1.7, I'll do 1. it. 1.7. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Master is kind. Master Cannon. is kind. <laughs> um, what are you guys oh. gonna have for lunch? I'm really hungry. I don't know what to have. I might order some takeout. Treat I might just you know? cut oh, the wing really off Quill idea. and just eat that. <laughs> uh, that's doable. Jeez. Suddenly, chat are like, "Hello, reduce the target." That's doable. Oh. Let's do oh. it. That's doable. Uh, thank you to Chestnut Brushwalker for do donating. It. Do it, cowards. <laughs> 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 oh, we've got we got a funny message from Chestnut Brushwalker says, "Oh God, I think Tom's gonna have to do this though because I don't have the best voice for this. Please take all day to read this as this is an ent buying the bundle and then they've spelled out good morning. So could, oh. you do, could someone do an ent saying good morning? They've just got the uh, really slow voice, right? Mm. Good morning. I think slower than that." Good they're, like, they're like breathy as well, like gentle, morning. breathy voiced. It's kind of like Dory doing whale sounds. Yeah. Good if you the hum or noises in between as well that they do. Oh god. <sighs> this is now an ent ASMR stream. <laughs> I've just got lipstick on my nose as well. This is why I don't. Anything that's worth saying takes a long time to say. I guess, yeah. yeah. Donate. Donate. To. Cherry. Um, 
thank you to Yanka for, uh, for for donating as well. And thank you to Robbie. Robbie does M. Robert Ooh, Ruddus, Robbie does M. Am I too late for the Civ stream pound drive? You are a bit late. Civ was like on Monday? When the hell was Civ? I'm sure that was I Monday. I think it was, yeah. Yeah. Um, a bit late, so... but welcome to the one pound 2p drive. Yeah, yeah. Welcome. Um, yeah, that was Monday. What day is today? Friday. Right. That's so, fine. Yeah. Um, we've got a recipe from Gaming Inc. It says roll quill in some buttermilk, Ooh. then flour, then roll it back in buttermilk, then flour again, and then have it double battered, deep fry in some sort of peanut oil. While it's still hot, toss in some Frank's red hot sauce and butter melted together, and serve oh. with blue cheese dressing. You'll go back for seconds. That is, mwah, that is a good recipe. That no, is a good recipe. I've always been curious oh about God. the whole melting butter into Frank's red hot sauce, though, because I make buffalo wings. And I'll be honest, I've never melted the butter into the sauce because I'm just like, that's that's a lot of butter. That is a lot of butter. However, maybe that's the amount of butter you need to um, be able to... You need to grease up your throat, you know? <laughs> if you're going to be eating something sharp like a quill doll. That's it. <laughs> you need, you need it. Down, you need man. it. Oh, you need to grease up your throat. If you're going to go raw on quill, you need to grease up your throat. Okay. Mm. Man, I love you know? I love butter so much. Don't even Here we are. Oh, get me started. I love it, but it does not love me. Lube Rupert... that throat for me. <laughs> I just saw that same <laughs> message. Lube that throat. Lube <laughs> that throat. <laughs> Lube it. Anyway. Uh, wow. We we do have a very serious message from Leo Keros in chat who says Please don't eat the doll. You're asking for stomach troubles. Thank you, Leos. Uh, uh, I, I will. I think I'm sure Tom will take that into consideration. Um, <laughs> um no. <laughs> no. I mean, it's for charity. You know. I think. So you want pain? That if, if, if my suffering charity. leads to <laughs> uh, a lot of people's happiness, I think my stomach can take it. And if it can't, then, well, you'll see me as a cause for next year's Jingle Jam. <laughs> so next year's Jingle Jam. <laughs> oh, hold on. Oh, the oh VLC show has gone a bit funny. Do oh, oh. It's breaking apart at the seams. <laughs> the colour. <laughs> VLC. Okay. Jingle, jam, Jingle Jam 2021, save Tom for Christmas. Yeah, that's what that'll be. VLC, you're tearing me apart. <laughs> <laughs> VLC, no. <laughs> No, you've made it so far, VLC. You can it's do it, VLC. It's not happening, Re. It's it's going. It's, it's not going. happy, boy. <laughs> Donate to Jingle Jam so Kim can get some better internet <laughs> for next year's Jingle Jam. No, whoa, 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 oh, whoa, 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 yes. whoa. None yes. of the money is being donated. It is going no. to us. No, Let's just no, make no, that no. extremely clear. <laughs> I like how you say um, that now and not at the beginning when we're donating so that I could get some help putting my socks on. Oh, um. <laughs> uh, that's true. That's true. Um. No, but honestly, none of the money's going to us. Not, none of the money's no. going to us. We, we promise. Just me. For my just, stomach. Yeah, just just Tom and his stomach. I like yeah, again, you can talk about it all you want with your precious little <laughs> quill stomach, but as soon as I'm like, I need better internet because this stream is No, I mean <laughs> if I do eat the quill, I'm gonna need all the help I can get. I mean you need that. Thank you. It's fine. It's fine. Right, we have oh, ten minutes left. Uh -oh. What can we do in ten minutes to like really entertain the masses? What do they want? Uh, we do have a £50 uh, donation from Defilt, who says, Jingle Jam is the best. Thanks, you guys, for the work that you do. I don't know why I said that in Aww. such a dumb way. Um, thank you as well to Nil Live, who says, Looks like Quill is for your lunch. Um, yeah. And thank you to Axel as well, who says, Merry Christmas from Sweden. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas. Ooh. Merry oh. Christmas. Sorry, Tom, are we keeping you awake here? Are, are you... Sorry, sorry, I'm trying not to yawn. <laughs> it was a late, late night again. <laughs> so let's see, if you went to bed at four in the morning, what time did you get up? Nine. Nine. So you had five hours of sleep? Four. I definitely four. didn't get to sleep at four. Oh, okay. So uh. poor Tom had, had four hours. Of I can't see Discord, Nightjar. <laughs> Hold on, let's see if I can get it on my phone. Um, but yeah. 
Well, I'm, are you glad that you spent four hours, uh, uh, the, three hours raising money for charity, Tom? Yeah, yeah, of course I am. Plus, I got to see some very cool games. Like, I, I yeah. uh, never even really looked at Sunless Sea, turns out. It's really damn cool. It's really yeah. damn cool. Yeah. I'm going to give it a go. Um, Transistor, I'm a huge fan of Hades, and seeing that this is very different, but very different in a cool way to yeah. Bastion and Hades as well. I mean, it's, it's really, really nice. I, I kind of like that turn based really art. Mm. Also, the music's great. Yeah. Yeah. Really good. Um, I, don't want to, I don't want to talk too more, not much about the story because they don't, they don't tell you anything about it and I don't want it to get spoilery for people that might want to play it. Right. But it's it's very good. She says it's clicking the full story, story button. <laughs> yeah, full story, story and here we go. Um, so yeah, I missed, it's, it's really good. I missed a donation message from Nightjar who said, Enjoy si enjoying cyberpunk, Tom. Oh, wait. Peppo giggle. Yeah, that's that's what she said. Thank you. Thanks. Nice I think it's, I wasn't even staying up late playing Cyberpunk. I was staying up late watching the video game awards, which went on for hours. <laughs> Jesus Christ, they know how to pad time. <laughs> like, I love that. Didn't Among Us win Best Multiplayer? It did, yeah. And Last of Us basically won every other award. Uh, Hades won Best Indie Game, so there you go. Oh, yeah. Um, nice. But well I was mainly deserved. watching to see all the uh, all the announcements. But good lord, it was so long. Christ! And Vin oh my god, that was the categorically the worst trailer I have ever seen. Yeah. Oh, what was it for? For a game. It was Vin Diesel <gasps> running around with like a spear, like is killing dinosaurs and stuff. Is that what was um, all over Reddit this morning? I thought I was it, gone to it a might have been. Now, Was he wearing a crown? The trailer itself, no, may, possibly, but um, the trailer he was had... It had a load of black frames in between some shots, so it was poorly edited. There was these blood <laughs> animations that looked terrible. Like, for a cinematic trailer, it looked like it was put together in, like, a week or something. It was fucking oh, awful. Oh, my Except God. Except Vin Diesel was in it for some reason. And it was for yeah. Ark 2? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Oh, it was just so weird. What? That sounds amazing. It I, was that's terrible. Incredible. I need to see um, this now. <laughs> and they're going to be making an ARC uh, cartoon thing, I think, from Netflix or something. And it's got what? Jared Butler, David Tennant, Vin Diesel. Um, that are you kidding me? This, that must be the crown thing that I saw. I saw an image on Reddit today of Vin Diesel in a crown and everyone was going mad for it. It was Oh my nuts. God, that's hilarious. It was nuts. And it, 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 it's got all the making. What is happening, by the way? This is awesome. It's a fun little, fun little backstory cutscene. Oh, we're not going to get DMCA'd, are we? <laughs> I don't think so. I think all the music is original. G good. Yeah. G Knowing good. Supergiant, it definitely is. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this sounds like the same singer as um, Eurydice in Hades. That's really cool. Maybe it is. Uh, just remember, if you want to hear this song. Yeah. Humble Bundle. Get the bundle. bundle. Transistor. Transistor. She oh, is apparently the same singer as Eurydice. Ah. And people call me dumb. I am. You are. But they do. So. Ashley Barrett. Get the bundle. Um, but yeah. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Get, it's get... not Humble Bundle. I'm sorry. I'm, <laughs> I'm half asleep. I apologise. What time, it's what, time did, what time did you stop, Free? What time did you stop playing? Well, I started at like mid. I stopped at midnight, so I'm not too bad. But my yeah. brain is just mush. Yeah. My brain is mush all the time. See, I'd like, I'd like you all to know in chat seven. that I haven't played Cyberpunk yet because I, I, I was spending all of yesterday getting ready for this. So I was playing, replaying Sun of the Sea just to refresh my brain. I was playing Dungeon of Nuchubek, um, and yeah, I was, I was setting all the OBS stuff. And so I haven't played it yet. So after I'm done with this stream, peace out. I'm um, don't talk to me until Monday. Um, I'm gonna immerse myself. I'm gonna get in there, get all up in there. Um, we have. 500 pounds from S Mitchell 86, guys. No message. Crikey. Thank you so much. No message. Um, S Mitchell 86, another one of these kind oil barons, like recall, just comes in, slides in. So S Mitchell 86 donated at the beginning of the stream as well. So there we go. 
What, Holy what crap. a way to begin. What a way to end. Thank you. Thank um, you very much. Yeah. But that is crazy generous. Thank you so much. 500. No message. He never leaves a message. In all the donations he's made over the years, never leaves a message. What a, a mysterious message. enigma. I know. An yeah. absolute what a, enigma. What a handsome stranger. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, what a, what a wonderful, generous, kind soul! Right, God. I'm gonna I'm gonna jump to the main screen. So, Ree, you don't have to keep playing this if you don't want to. <laughs> Okie dokie. Well, I mean, can, um, but um, I'm I just gonna probably stop. I'm gonna but, jump to all oh of us. Oh my god! Okie dokie. I'm gonna jump to all of us so we can wrap up and hand over to the game jam. Um, who's hosting the yeah. game jam? Yeah. Uh, it's going to be Ben, Matt Castle. I think Chris Yules is in it as well. I'm not 100% certain. Um, on the schedule, it says Ben and Matt Castle. Okay. Um, over 200 games submitted to the Game Jam. Holy crap, So um, many. Go check them out. Um, last year, there were some amazing games and some genuinely charming, nice little games and also a Lewis simulator. So this <laughs> year, expect even better. Um, yeah. Well, I won't say that, but <laughs> there's 200, so there's got to be some real ding dongs in there. And if you like ding dongs, then stick around. Um, <laughs> nice. Ding dongs. <laughs> if you like, speaking of ding dongs, <laughs> stick around, around for the ding dongs. <laughs> speaking of ding dongs, I'm going to go back to playing Cyberpunk. <laughs> hey, I'm going to eat some food and then I'm going to immerse myself. Oh, nice. Well, thank you so much. Thank you, Tom and Ree, for joining me this morning uh, to Quite play right. a bunch of excellent games. Yeah. Um, if you enjoyed the games today, go check out the Tiltify bundle, um, you know, and you can get them all there. Thank you, everybody in chat, for keeping this company thank and you. for um, donating so generously. Um, we will be back ah. on Sunday. <laughs> what are you doing, Tom? What are you doing? Ah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Tom incinerating Tom. himself for your entertainment. <laughs> Is it still uh, raining, Tom? Is it cloudy? Yeah, what's oh, it like out there? miserable out there. I'm going to close oh. it again. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we will be back on Sunday with High Rollers. So you can, if you like us and you want to see more of us and, and there's three more of us as well, the six of yeah. us, yeah. High Rollers D&D &D will be back on Sunday, 5 p.m. GMT. Um, That's a point. To do if more you, jingle if you, jamming. If you didn't, if you didn't like us, then there's three others that are yeah. better than us. So you uh, <laughs> if you did like us, then we're the best ones in there anyway. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. It's all right. See you on Sunday. Yeah, it's I don't know what we're doing guarantee. for high rollers, but that's when the high rollers take their jingle jam uh, slot. Um, is this live, Mr. Tubby says? No. 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 no all pre-recorded. All pre-recorded. <laughs> we, we're, we're all pre-recorded here. Um, but yeah. on head. Right. I need to make a note that I need to make a Twitch account, Mr. Tubby, and I need to comment at this exact time. So okay. Reply to that, so it's okay. Obviously not. Yeah. Reset the okay. cycle. Okay. Okay. Reset the cycle. Yeah. Okay. okay. Right. I'm gonna. I don't know how the handover is gonna ha happen. So, I'm, it, studio, if you're watching, I'm just gonna play the the best friend song, and and then and 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 hopefully that will be the end. But, but, I but, think it will be safer if you go offline so they can actually take over. <laughs> I don't know how it happens. How does it happen? Who knows? I'm gonna, magic is how. Magic. Okay. So we're gonna go offline. Yeah. But. But so stick around. Stick around. Make sure you refresh yeah. in about a couple minutes when it goes live for the game jam. Okay. Yeah. Goodbye. See you Sunday. Good. Bye, bye, everybody. Yeah. Thanks for the donations bye. and messages. Yeah, bye. 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 Bye.